What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my channel for another Let's Play. Today, we're going to be starting Devil May Cry 1 on the HD collection, just because I want to get the trophies. This is going to count for my uh, beating every uh, PS2 game. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, this is going to count for my PS2 beating every game kind of challenge thing that I'm doing. But I also want to get the uh, platinum for it just because it's going to be fun. I don't want to have to replay it later. So that's why I'm kind of doing the two birds, one stone kind of thing. Anyways, we're going to start with number one. Would you like to continue? Sure. There's nothing to continue because I've never played this, but I don't know why I would ask that. Let's rock, baby. All right, so we're going to be playing on normal for the first playthrough. It's going to take a couple playthroughs to actually like beat the game, but uh, yeah. So yeah. Anyways, let's get started. Two millenniums ago, there was a war between the human world and the other, the underworld. But somebody from the underworld woke up to justice and stood up against this legion alone. His name was Sparta. Later, he quietly reigned the human world and continued to preserve harmony until his death. He became a legend. The legendary Dark Knight, Sparta. Devil may cry. I'm sorry, we closed at nine. Again, no password. I can't seem to get any real business. Whoa, slow down, babe. Well, well, what do we have here? Nature calls? It's in the back. So. You must be the handyman who'll take any dirty job. Am I correct? Almost. I only take special jobs. If you know what I mean. You're the man who lost a mother and a brother to evil 20 years ago. The son of the legendary Dark Knight Sparta, Mr. Dante. Well, the way I figure it, in this business a lot of your kind comes around. And if I kill each one that comes, eventually I should hit the jackpot sooner or later. In that case, you should be used to this sort of thing. <laughs> Are you really the son of the legendary Dark Knight, Sparta? Didn't your daddy teach you how to use Sword. <laughs> Time to go to work, guys. Even as a child, I had powers. There's demonic blood in me. What strength? You were the first one to know about my vengeance. It looks like I'm getting closer. It seems that way, but I'm not your enemy. My name is Trish. I came here to seek your help, to put an end to the underworld. What? Twenty years ago, Mundus, the Emperor of the Underworld, resurrected. 
Mundus. Yes. His powers were sealed by Sparta. He's attempting to gain control of the human world once again. He has been preparing to open the gate on Malay Island. The castle is above this cliff. Come on, let's go! Huh! All right, so we get to play now. That was a pretty cool intro. So, uh, I just want to make it clear. Playing through this game on normal mode, which I'm pretty sure I'm on normal mode. I don't even remember picking a uh, difficulty, to be honest. Um, is there a way for me to actually check that? Uh, I don't think there's, but anyways. Um, there's going to be three trophies you're going to want to look out for on your first playthrough. One is collecting all the guns. There's five of them. You already have a set right here, which I don't know how to actually shoot because I don't really remember, to be honest. Let's see, is there a way? Okay, so R1 and then squares to shoot. And then you want to collect all the blue orb fragments, which kind of upgrades your health throughout the game. And then just trying to find like every enemy and fight them to add them to your, uh, I think files, this thing right here. Um, if you do miss stuff, I'm pretty sure it all carries over to the next, uh, like, playthrough, as long as you're on the same, uh, save file. But, uh, yeah. Let me pause the recording real quick and make sure I'm on the right difficulty, because I am not sure. Alright, so I'm pretty sure it just starts with the normal. I looked around and stuff, but I didn't find anything. So, let's get started. So, we're technically in a prologue right now, not mission one just yet. But, uh, there is a yellow orb right here. These are used to, uh, basically resurrect you if you die. We're gonna try not to use that, because that is a missable trophy to play through the game without dying at all, so... I'm pretty sure there's something up here. There, right there. Blue orb fragment. Let's go. Alright, let's continue. So, I am probably gonna pause every time I collect one, just because, uh, I need to mark down where I get them for future videos and stuff like that. If I want to make like a where's all blue fragment kind of video. But anyways, let's enter this castle. Also, I've played this game before. I never got far enough because I was a child at the time and it used to scare me. <laughs> You'll see why in a little bit. But uh, yeah, so we're starting mission number one right now. Mission start. All right. So we are inside here. Got a staircase right here. There's these red orbs. Um, these are kind of just like the currency of the game, I'm pretty sure. You use it to uh, buy stuff. So, for example, if we come towards the camera, there's this door right here. Which has a hand. I don't know if that actually hurts you. You need 45 red orbs. Alright. And then, right over here, there's another blue door, which we cannot go in right now. It is sealed shut. A rusty key may help. So that's basically our, our objective right now is to find a rusty key. I'm just going to run around this bottom floor and, uh, you know, try to get any collectibles. I'm just going to clear this bottom floor. I think I got it all though. I think it was just that red orb that we collected. Yeah. Okay. Let's head back to the middle and start heading up these stairs right here. This camera changes so much. Is there anything below the horse? No, there's not. Okay, so we see a blue orb right there. I might try to go for that real quick. Can I just jump over there? Oh, okay. Yeah, I forgot you can wall jump in this game. So let me try it. Okay. It's like a blue orb right here. Alright. Got that one. Let's continue. Also, those are just fragments. Uh, I think you collect four fragments and it creates one orb. Like actual blue orb. So we got that part cleared out. Uh, we can head to the right over here. This way is blocked, but I believe we could jump over here. I just completely failed that. <laughs> okay, let me try this again. Can I jump up these stairs? If this camera will stop moving. No, I missed it again, dude. Let's 
kind of a hard jump. Okay, you could just ju jump up there by walking or whatever while jumping. And head up here. Take a ride over here. Yeah, so the atmosphere is already like really cool. Kind of creepy. Once again, this game used to creep me out as a kid, so I never got that far. <laughs> okay, let me just check over here real quick. Yeah, you'll see why it creeps me out in a little bit. Like, I know it's probably not too scary, but you know, I was a child and I was scared of, or I was a scared. I was afraid of a lot of things. Like, come on, I was a, I, I was afraid to play freaking Harry Potter one and probably two, <laughs> just because there was like ghosts and stuff floating around. All right, jump across this gap, grab the shadow orb. Is there anything else? No, there's not. I almost just fell. I guess that's another way to get the orbs below. You just drop down. All right. So there's one area we haven't checked out up here, which is this, this other side. Come towards the camera, collect these. I needed 45. I think these bigger ones give me five, right? Yeah. Okay. So we can open that door now. Sorry, I had to pause it there for a second. I am kind of following a guy for the collectibles, so I don't because I really don't want to miss anything, and I want to get the all the uh, collectibles done in one playthrough because doing it hard is gonna be hard. <laughs> all right, so next blue fragment is gonna be in one of these armor stands. How do I swing my sword? Triangle. Yeah. All right, let's continue on from that. Destroy this. Um, coming up, we are going to fight our first enemies I believe um and we'll start getting enemy file entries I think there's 14 in this level total so hopefully I don't miss anything that's one that I'm kind of worried about which I don't think you have to do in one playthrough once again as long as you're on the same save I think it kind of carries over but uh yeah um I'm trying to focus on like PS2 games right now but like I'll do these like platinum runs for the games that have them on the newer consoles but uh, I also don't <laughs> hope it doesn't spend or I don't spend too much time like doing them. Hmm, a hole in the roof. Wonder what's up there. All right, I'm just going to destroy everything because I want to get as many of these red orbs as I can. All right, let's head up here if I can jump right. Like that real quick. Can I break out? Let me out. I also like how we just totally like left the girl. Or she left us, I should say. Alright. This looks special. Rusty key. Cool. Alright. And now this is why this game used to creep me out. Because you got these guys. <laughs> So I'm kind of curious if each enemy like just on their own count as a, oh, I have to hold R1, I forgot about that, count as an enemy entry. Because the way that this like guy thing that I'm following is like structured is kind of weird. Yeah, these guys kind of have a lot of health. Alright, so I killed two. Let's check this out real quick. Enemy. Okay, I got two. So, yeah, I think these are right. Three out three, three out three. All right, so I redid all this and came back to here because I kind of did that last part wrong. After you collect this key, um, you're going to want to just basically move away from these guys and dodge and keep checking your uh, enemy files to... Uh, see if you get all these because you should have 10 enemy file entries after you're done with this so i'm kind of just gonna come up here and do this i just taunted them nice once they start throwing stuff ow like, I don't know if that unlocked it. I don't know. I'm not completely sure what I'm doing, to be honest. Okay, so. Two out of seven. 
And two out of seven. And I think I have to keep dodging. Because they should do something that will, like, capture me or something, I think? I don't know. I don't know. I'm going to pause until I get these. Alright, so I think I got what I was looking for. I am at four out of seven. They did, like, a screechy noise thing. So I can kill these guys right here. Don't know if I actually got them or not. I am definitely at a lower health than what I want to be at, which is unfortunate. So I'm hoping, I mean, I have this. I think this will heal me. Yeah, okay. I just, I didn't want to use it, but I'm also going to save because there is the uh, don't use any of the yellow orbs. So... If you do have to use one, then you could just come back to your save. Sorry, I am slow at explaining things. Okay, so next thing we're going to go for is another entry. It's after killing the two enemies in this room. You drop down the hole, find another one, stand still on wardrobe that is underneath it. Eventually, it will throw its crescent-shaped blades at you. So that is what we are looking for for this next one. I'm sorry if this is very slow, by the way. I really just don't want to miss anything. Come on, buddy. Do it. Come on, buddy. Throw your things at me. Okay. And I think that should do it. We should be a 5 out of a 10 right now. For both of these. Okay, yeah, we're 5 out of 10 right now. So, we can continue. Oh. Alright, cool. Alright. So, that should be all those four now. Alright, so let's go through this door now. And then... I don't know if we can actually do anything in here. There are three openings to insert something. Okay, so that's gonna be further. And we can jump in the water. I think the next thing is right here. Alright. And that's four out of four, so we should get one. Nice. And that is our first trophy of the game, which means we're locked in. All right, let's move on. So now that we have that, there's this ladder here. I don't think we can go up there, right? No, nope, I'm not close enough. There's a ladder, but the lid is closed and I can't go through. All right, so let's head back. I believe we could just head down these stairs now and I'm gonna go back to this to the first area. I, I did not know that they respawn like that to be honest. Alright, let's head through this door, I think. Right? Yeah, okay. To the left over here. Back in this main area. Let's just head to the left over here. Since we got that rusty key, we can go through these doors now. All right, now we're in here. Make sure you destroy everything you can. Should I get all the red orbs? Sorry, I'm not trying to make this as like a walkthrough or a tutorial for the whole thing. It's just, I don't know. I don't really know what to talk about most of the time. I'm not much of a talker. All right, head over here. Let's hop up top of this train and get the next blue orb. All right, let's continue. Um, That should be the last blue orb for this mission or this episode, whatever you want to call it. Alright, let's head over here. Start attacking the crap out of this thing so it lights up. Oh, I probably should have saved. Whoops. I actually don't know what... Where you go when you load these. Like, I don't know if it brings you exactly where you saved it from, or... Like a certain checkpoint, I guess. Uh, Alright, so there's five of these guys. I'm gonna kill these two real quick. Because we want to leave one. There's gonna be one with daggers. I honestly don't know which one it is or if it's just all these guys. I'm assuming it's that guy just because he's wearing a different outfit. 
Alright. Let's collect that stuff. Green orb that can... Okay, so those give me health. Cool. Whoops, that's not who I want to hit. Alright. So, for this next entry, we want to actually turn our backs to this guy. This may take a couple tries. Apparently, he... You want him to do a, an attack where you have to, like, shake back and forth. Which I don't know if that was it or not. Let's just see. Just so we don't have to tank too many. So one, two, three, four, five. Okay, so yeah. That is what we wanted. They get on your back and start stabbing you. So now we can finish this guy off. Unfortunately, some of these files, like, actually make you get hit. I'm happy these guys are kind of color coordinated though makes it a little bit easier okay so for here there's gonna be a, one of these enemies with a shotgun so you're gonna want to keep that guy alive for a second but he's still left over there so let's just take out these guys real quick this game is so cool dude okay so let this guy just shoot you i don't know if you have to be a certain distance okay there's two of them so Hopefully one of them shoots me. Let's just stand close. Nope. That's not what we want. Come on, shoot me. I don't believe that's what we want. Yeah, no. He has to shoot you. Shoot me, people. Actually, let me grab these real quick. There we go. So... Oh, that should complete these, right? Okay, yeah. Seven out of seven for that one. Seven out of seven for that one. Cool. Hey! I don't need to be shot anymore. Now I'm scared. Oh god. That's unfortunate. Okay, I'm gonna have to reload now. Come on, there we go. Alright, hey, we got some health back. Cool. Got full health, actually. Alright, so, end of that with 7 out of 7. That's kind of annoying because I have to replay a lot of that. But, uh, yeah, we should be able to just finish this level now. Because we still got the blue orb right there, and I don't know if we... I don't know if we have a fragment, actually. I don't know how to check, check that, to be honest. Yeah, I don't know. I guess we'll see. Let me on. Bring me up. Kind of curious what the actual point of that was, because I don't think I got anything for that. Okay, so. I can just destroy these guys. Actually, I think the point is we want to be able to get through that door if we didn't go down there. Once it's blocked off right there. All right. All right, cool. All right. And that should do for this uh, mission. I'm just going to do this one more time. I don't think it really matters, but. It counts your save. is cool. All right. I keep pressing that button on accident. All right, let's just head through this door. Oh, that's the whole mission. Okay, cool. 94 orbs. See? That's it. Probably because I took a lot of damage. I don't know. But you kind of have to to uh, get some of these uh, entries. Uh, yeah. Pretty cool. I got almost 200 of those. Anyways, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number two, Judge of Death. Let's head right into it. All right. So we got a creepy face up there. We got a painting right here. It's a landscape painting. There's... An eerie aura or surrounding it. All right. Is that this castle? Hey. Right. 
Boom, destroy everything. Give me the orbs. All right, cool. Next blue orb fragment. All right. How's that count up? Blue orbs? Okay, never mind. All right, and then there's this thing, which I think we interact with, power up. Um, so here you can buy blue orbs, which I think we have to do for the um, mission. So I'm probably just going to be saving up for those this entire like playthrough. It's not like it's bad or anything because they give you health. So uh, yeah, let's head out of here. And get attacked. Get out of here. Alright. Get out of here. Okay, that's all of them. Oh, it's not all of them. Okay. Just waiting for your friends to be destroyed. I feel like those don't do like that much damage. I'm also kind of happy that there's not like a ammo limit in this game. Just infinite ammo. Get out of here. All right, just destroyed them, and apparently they keep spawning here. Is this just infinite? I'm gonna get this guy because they'll actually throw stuff. Oh, they all throw stuff apparently. Ow. Ow. Get away from me. Okay, at least he gave me ammo. Or health, high ammo, whatever. Well, I can look at this thing, so my brain's not saying the right stuff. Okay, cool. So, the problem is, if I go through any of these doors, they're gonna spawn again. There's a painting of a middle aged man. Interesting. Uh, how many orbs do I have right now? Not quite 300. There's a sculpture of a female. In agony with a sword pierced through her chest. Wait. I can hear a voice. I am Alistair, the weak shall give their heart and swear their eternal loyalty to me. Okay. <gasps> Do I get a sword? D okay. That's a little painful. <laughs> Get a little montage of using my new sword. That was pretty cool. Uh, way of acquiring it, though. Getting stabbed by it and then lifting up through it. Does that mean all these enemies are just going to be a lot easier for me to like kill now? Give the possessor lightning speed and aerial capabilities. I did not know that was a thing in this game, to be honest. Um, I like... Okay, you can select. I think. Oops, I did not mean to re-click that. Okay, cool. Alright, let's head through this door. 
destroy everything. Also, I think we already got, uh, yeah, we got the only blue orb in this level, so you don't really have to worry about that. What's that? First, we're going to go over here and destroy this and you get a shotgun. Let's go. All right. So just because we got that, I'm going to save it real quick. Not that that really does anything because you still have to kind of play through the mission, which is kind of unfortunate. But uh, yeah. All right. Is there anything else over here? No. Hold on. I got to itch my eye real quick. All right, let's continue. This next part is going to be kind of hard, not like gameplay wise, but like getting the entries that I need for this. So I uh, do. I keep pressing the button. So I'm kind of not looking forward to this. All right. The Grim Reaper like devil is whatever depicted. The key is in the embedded. Should I take it? Sorry, I suck at reading, especially like right now. I don't know why. Um, I'm definitely going to take it. Rusty key. All right. Anything else in here? I do not think there is. You can see a room on the other side. There must be another way to get there. Can I just break my way through? I did not mean to like click that again. Break, wait, break through, break through. Let's head this way. I equipped my shotgun, by the way. I paused it and equipped my shotgun. I used the rusty key. What was that noise? Okay, so there's stuff up there. Uh, okay, that's where I just came from. What's this? The statue of an angel, the guardian of a god. All right, now there's an immense power that will not allow anyone to get closer. Before I can confront the lion, I'll need a sign. Will you do anything for me? No. Okay, so staircase right there. There's a statue of an angel. Okay. Let's just head up these stairs, I guess. Wait, what's the store? It's an engraving of a lion. There's something written. Only those who the lion has accepted can set me free. No, 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 no. Okay. Bro, that's so good. Alright. Do I jump across here? I don't know where I'm going, to be honest. Oh god. Okay, he died immediately. Bro, that's so good. I really hope there's not any, like, bad reasons to, like, be using this. I don't think there is, but... There's something written, a god stands before thee. To open the path, use thy strength to drive it back. Oh, okay, before I do that, I need to, like, look around here. Like, what's this? There's something engraved beneath the opening. This is where the guiding souls gather. Okay. Okay, let's just do this. You get out of the way. All right. Am I going the right way? I feel like I'm like missing stuff. What's this? Staff of judgment. The staff that shines with a mysterious light. All right, let me save real quick because that seems important. I'm going to save on a different thing this time. 
No reason why. I don't know. All right. Okay, this is where the next enemy comes in. Bruh, it's like a phantom. What the heck? Bruh, that's so creepy. It's like giving me goosebumps. Oh god. Okay. So, did that do what I needed it to? Two out of seven. Okay, so I got one for floating down and the one, probably two there. When they are coming down with their scissors, there's a short moment in time when they're off guard. If you attack at the right moment, you'll be able to damage them critically. I hope that's what I needed. Okay, so this is going to be kind of stressful because like there's a couple things that we can do. Or that we need to do to get these guys, like, their entry. Please tell me that was one. It was, but I don't think it was the right one. Yeah, that definitely wasn't the one I wanted. Okay, so I need one to, like circle around me. Bro. This is not going how I wanted it to. Five. Okay, so I have one, two, three, four. I need five and six. So I don't know if I can actually get six. I don't think I got everything. Yeah, I need six, which is you need to be standing. Stun one of them again, but this time you want to be standing as close to them as possible on the right side. When in position, shoot it in the face with a shotgun at point blank. It should die instantly. Keep in mind that you need to do this with one that you haven't damaged already. So yeah, that's kind of unfortunate. Dang it, dude, I kind of want a more to uh, spawn right there. I can do this in the first secret mission, though, so that's kind of good. Which is in the next uh, mission. So, I guess right now, I was going to try to finish this without dying. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you doing? Try to see here, killing all these things. Uh, sure. All right, cool. Okay, I guess that's that. That mission is cleared. I only missed one entry, which is kind of annoying, but uh, I guess we should be able to do that in secret mission one. If not, I think I could always come back and get this in the next playthrough on a higher difficulty, or just I don't know if this game has a mission select or anything like that, but yeah. Anyways, if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up everybody, welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. 
Today we're playing mission number three, but before we start, we're gonna head over here to Power Ups, down to Alistor, and get this uh, first upgrade because the guy that I'm following says this makes it easier to get one of the blue ore fragments in this level, so yeah. Nice. Let's hop right into this mission. All right. I really need to figure out how to like dodge and stuff. Okay. I don't know how I just did that to be honest. Okay, R1 and then left, right, jump. And now it's not working. Yeah, I don't know, we'll figure it out. Let's go interact with this thing. The pride of line is granted only to those who choose the path of trials. Oh, oops. I probably should have figured out how to use that thing I just bought because I have no idea to be honest. All right, let's head out the, these doors right here. Down the stairs. I think the fragment is somewhere over here. I don't know exactly where it is, but I don't even know if it's like spawned in yet. I might have to do this first. I like how this bridge just kind of leads out to nothing over here. We do have some red orbs here though, which I think are five each. What's this? This symbol resembles the staff of Hermes that's used in the art of alchemy. Hmm, I can feel some kind of mysterious force, but I just can't quite understand yet. Sorry, I'm like talking. Oh no. Oh, I could have been pressing circle through all that. Sorry, I'm a Terrible reader, by the way. <laughs> Alright. Now we can interact with this thing. Say it's go back to the path. Thou shall return from the abyss. With thy line heart. And thou shall receive the pride of line. Okay, I already second reading. When it comes to old English, I, I'm even worse. Um, just a little update. I'm still missing the 7 out of 7 for this. I think it's the 6 paragraph for this. But... We will be able to get this mission as long as I do it right. So hopefully I do that. Well, that's uh, unlucky. <laughs> get hit by lightning. And it just destroys the whole bridge. Nice. All right. So we come through here. We're constantly getting health taken away, apparently, in this area. Okay. Wait. I think that's all you have to do. I think once these spawn in... Yeah, okay, two, two. Once they spawn in, and then once you start getting, like, bit by these things... Dude, can I get out of here, please? Yeah, once he starts to bite you, I think you get the second one, and then just them spawning in alone gets you, uh... The first entry for it. Get out of here. And I think we just come here. Okay, cool. They give you a full heal. All right, so before we head back in, we're actually going to come back across here. Go, go, go. That was close. Go, go, go. Oh, I just fell. All right. I think we just fight these things again, right? Yeah, okay. Get out of here. So you get multiple chances you get the two entries, but you should get your first try, as long as you let them, like, attempt to bite you. Hopefully we get the health, though. Okay, we do. Well, I need to grab it. Go, go, go. Okay, I spawned us over here anyways. Okay, here's the first blue thing for this level. Alright, now we gotta get back across without falling again. Hopefully we can do that. I just don't, I don't like that it doesn't show like your uh, shadow when you jump, so you can't like fully know where you are. Go, go, go. Oh god. Okay, made it. 
All right, I th think we can see the thing up there. I th it's that floating piece up there. I just, I really don't know how to get it. I might have to pause and try to figure this out real quick. Yeah, I'm gonna pause real quick. Okay, I think I figured it out. We can climb up this part and get up here if I do right, right there. And then that's where you need to use the thing, but I honestly don't know how. Nope, well, I just used that on accident, which is kind of unfortunate because now I, uh, Lost some of it for the fight. Go, go, go. Okay, I need to figure out how to use my ability real quick. Okay, I think I almost just hit it. The ability thing I've bought does not seem to be working. But I think you can do that and grab it. I'm just kind of missing it. So hopefully I can get one of these tries. Get it. Okay, I'm just gonna, that's like the idea of how to get it. I'm just gonna pause and then cut back to when I do get it. I got it. And I used the ability, I think. Okay, so six. Uh, just gotta mark that down real quick. I think that's fire four, so yeah. Get a full orb. All right. So the way I did it, jump up here. Line up in the middle, face towards the platform, hold R1 and then Press triangle and it kind of flings you up there. That's crazy. So that's the ability I bought, by the way. But yeah, now we can actually continue. Sorry, I was reading something. I thought it was a cussing. Pride of Lion, a sign of the strong. It allows confrontation with the Lion Gatekeeper. This is a boss fight. Let's go. I just totally. Oh God. Okay. So this guy also has the enemy file thing. I think I got a couple right there. Okay, right here. He has seven. I got four out of seven. I got one, two, three, and six, I think. One of them's just for starting it. One of them's for when he used his first attack with the fireball. One of them's for me attacking when his mouth open, and then, and then it looks like the other one is for him trying to attack me with his tail. All right. So for the next two, you can only get six out of seven here, from what this guy says. Um, I want to keep like dodging him. I guess. Okay, that's another one right there. Sorry, I know it's annoying me going into this. Okay, yeah, so the last one should be, um... Let me see real quick. I need to jump above his body and slash downward onto it with Alistair. Okay. Okay, so like that. Hopefully that did. Tell me that did, please. If I can pause. No, that didn't work. Okay. 
Get away from me! Okay, that didn't hit, apparently. Dude, come on! There we go. That work? Please tell me that worked. Okay, that worked. Okay. Okay, so now we can just fight this guy normal. Get him! Okay, that wasn't smart. I kind of just wasted that. Dude, I don't know how to like hurt this guy a lot. Stay away from me. Looks like that was it. I remember that being so much more harder. I don't know if I ever actually beat that uh, boss as a kid. Alright, so next up, before we like continue on with the story, we can come back out here. I don't know if we actually have to go across this, but like, there's a little secret mission here. If you just hop off the edge right here, puts us back underwater. And so this is the first secret mission. Um, this is also where we're, we have a second chance of completing the uh, Sin Scissor enemy file. So we're going to go for that. Basically what I was doing wrong is I have to wait for him to attack with the scissors. And then I have to parry him by hitting the scissors in his hands. And then shoot him with the shotgun right next to him. And we gotta be very careful because our health is going down all the way. Or constantly. Okay. So wait for him to... Come on, dude. Do a better attack for me. Okay, I needed to jump there. Oh, I failed it. That's what you have to do, though. You have to be, like, right next to him to do it, though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Dang it, dude. I'm not getting it. I'm gonna have to do this again, probably. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do this again. Let me up. Yeah, I need to do that again, dude. I failed. I don't know how I'm supposed to get full health, though. But that kind of sucks. I think you have to do that to, like, actually successfully complete that mission, too. So that's kind of rough. Am I still like no health right now? I could do this. I'm going to sit here for a second, get my health back and then jump back down. I'm not going to get full health or anything, but yeah. All right. Got a little bit of health back. I don't think you, from what I read, I don't think you actually f die when you, uh, when it reaches the bottom, as long as you don't get hit. So let's retry this. I had to pause there for a second, which kind of sucks as my health kept going down. I really hope I'm not going to die here. Okay, yeah, so you don't actually die. I just can't be hit by him. Come 
Come on, buddy. Yeah, that definitely wasn't close enough. I'm gonna restart. All right. Did I get it? No, I didn't. Oh God. Okay, I'm restarting again. Actually, I'll keep trying this. Yeah, no, it didn't work. Okay. Wait for it to do it again. Dang it. Dude, come on. Just let me get it, game. I just don't know how to stay close to it because it seems like he gets too far away for me to do it. Dude, how is that not it? There we go. Okay, cool. So you parry it and then shove your shotgun into it and shoot and it gives it to you. Cool. That took me forever, so I was a little bit annoyed that one. Oh yeah, we finally uh, got it there. <laughs> secret mission cleared. Can you keep a secret? All right. So now that we finally did that, which I'll probably edit a lot of that out to be honest. Whoops, I did not mean to just fall. All right, cool little fact. After you complete the secret mission, it puts you with the skulls again. So I actually got health back from that. So that was actually pretty good. Because I don't know if this mission is actually any longer. Since it was kind of a boss mission, so it might not have anything else. Let's just see real quick. All right, cool. That was the mission. I'm probably going to edit a lot of that out. Oh, we got another trophy, it looks like. So I had to mark that down. But yeah, I'll try to edit out all the nonsense there. I'm not too sure what I'm going to do yet. But anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number four, Black Knight. Let's get right into it. So from what I've seen, um, you can kind of grind out red orbs in this mission, which I don't know if I'm going to do now or I might do later. And to do that now, you have to fight this thing because he gives you like Oh god. He's strong. He's best. Okay. Yeah, he's pretty strong. Okay. Anyways, every time you kill him, you get 500 red orbs. So, uh, yeah. But... I need to exit out of here so that it doesn't use one of those things. Alright, we're gonna try it again, but I forgot to actually do this real quick. Um, yeah, it's just do that, so I'm just gonna do it. Anyways, I just looked it up, and you get more power with those, like, with these things if you jump off a wall and do it, apparently. 
So I'm going to try to do that, and then you also do more damage while using, like, the special attack stuff. Okay, I'll show you in a second. Right, I'm, I'm going to try not to spend too much time here. Ow. Yeah, okay. Boom. Alright, so I'm going to sit here and do that for a little bit. I'll be back. Okay, I just got seeing red. Sorry, there's no sound, but yeah. So that trophy is for getting 10k red orbs. I've been grinding this for a bit. I have 9,000 right now, but added up all together, I have over 10,000. So I'm going to keep doing this. I might go until I get the 50k one. Not sure yet. We'll see, but I'll be back in a bit. All right. I think I'm going to get a trophy after this one. If not, the next one. All right. Blood flush red, let's go. All right. Sorry, I gotta see this over and over again, but this should be my last time for now to get the uh, 50,000 red orbs. And then after that, we can buy all of the blue orbs from the shop, plus some upgrades. Oh, I just got it. All right. Redemption, let's go. Alright, so let's just save this. Reset. Load this up. This is the whole process, by the way. And then once you get here, we can come here. Extras. Buy all the blue orbs. You need 16,650 to buy all those, by the way. And now that we have those, we could probably just... You know, buy all these things. Alright, and then if we want, we can upgrade all this stuff to, like, get a couple of those. Okay. Oh, wait. I don't want to do that, actually. Um, we could probably get that. And then... I guess just that, and then we'll save the rest for whenever. All right, let's hop right back into this. And now before we do that again, I think if we go right through here, this will put us into the next secret mission. Oops, so I'm trying to type something here on the side. Okay. And then I think we just have to kill 100 of these things by the time the uh, time runs out. Oops. Can I shoot these guys? I can. That's probably better because it like locks onto them. Oh god. I'm running out of time. I did not realize time was almost up. I need to reach out. I completely forgot there was a time limit. All right, let's attempt this again. I wonder what's better to do it this way or a sword. Probably this way. Okay, I don't know what is the best way to do this, to be honest. Maybe if I switch guns. Alright, switch guns. Yeah, this seems like it's so much better. Just because you can spam it a lot faster. Go, go, go. Dude, where are they? Oh, there's so much more over here. Okay, we got this next time.
Okay, let's just get all these guys. Come on, we got this time, please. We don't have it this time. Oh, come on. Why is it so hard? All right. Attempt number whatever. Okay, let's go up here now. Go, 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 go. Did I get it? Oh, please tell me I got that. I honestly don't know if I did or didn't. I did. Okay, cool. Let's go. All right. Now we can continue from here. We are probably going to have to uh, fight the big guy again. Phantom. But as we've seen before, that is not that hard. So let's head down here. You know what? I'll just skip it since you guys have seen me do it enough. <laughs> Alright. That is over. For the next uh, secret level, you come down to end the hallway where this painting is and then head to the right right here. And this only unlocks after you beat the last secret room, by the way, so you gotta do them in order. But it's gonna be the same thing uh, without using any weapons, so we gotta stomp on them. Get him! Okay, this isn't too hard. Now playing Holy Crap. Okay, I didn't think this was gonna be hard. No, we were too off. Are you kidding me? Yeah, come on. That sucks. All right. It's just number two. Oh, God. Did I get it? Oh, I don't think I got it again. I think I was at 99 that time. Are you kidding me? All right. I just don't think I can let them get too far this way. Dude, it didn't give me it again. Are you kidding me, game? Dude, that's so annoying. All right, hopefully final try here. Dude, come on. That was the worst one yet. All right, let's hope we get this time. I just don't know why sometimes it like does step on them and then sometimes it doesn't. Dude, it didn't give me it again. Oh, okay, thankfully. Thankfully it did. I was about to lose my crap right there. All right. I just want to check up on, um, not that, but that works. Actually, it doesn't because it doesn't let me actually go through here. Okay. Enemy, that's 7 out of 7, 7 out of 7, 7 out of 7, 6 out of 7. We'll get that later. 2 out of 2. Okay, cool. So we got all of them right now. All right. Let's head out here, get the secret mission clear, and then head on. All right, let's just skip that person because we already have all their stuff and we don't really have to fight them. Also, I might want to put this back on for now. 
Just because I feel like it does more damage. I think handguns are better when there's like more enemies. I don't know. Like the little spiders. Uh, where am I going actually? I think I'm going back. How do I get to the outside area? Is it through here? I honestly don't remember where I'm going. Oh god. Um, not there, not there. Let's head out here. Actually, I don't think I'm going the right way. No, 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 no. I think I have to... Where am I going? I'm going to pause real quick. Alright, I'm back in this room where the... Or, uh, Phantom attacked. Um, I'm pretty sure it's this way. Is it through this door? Okay, I think this is where we're supposed to go. Am I talking to you? Don't allow anyone to get closer. Before I can confront the line, I'll need a sign. Shall I use... Yes. Here sleeps the gatekeeper. Magical destruction will awaken him. What does that mean? Okay. <laughs> Ow. Okay, I want to check something real quick. Go down here. Shadow. Okay, so I have four out of it already. I have one, two, three, and five or seven. I don't know. Hold on. All right. Now we just have to keep shooting it with a gun, apparently. Oh, God. Do I have a heal? Yes, I do. Okay. I think that should have gotten a good amount, too. Okay, six out of eight. I have one, two, three, four, five, and six. So we just need seven, eight. Oh, okay. These last two seem kind of difficult. Oh, wait. And you need to switch to your handguns. And then we want to switch to a spear form. It says to like jump on top of it, but like I don't know exactly what it wants me to do there. Oh, wrong button. Ow. Okay. I don't know if I got it from that. Okay, no. I figure out how to like jump on it. Dude, come on. I need to pause real quick and figure this out. Alright. I think I know what to do now. That's not what I'm waiting for. I'm trying to stay far from it so it can do its little stabby thing. Nope. That's not what I wanted. Dude, why am I not jumping on it?
Dude, for some reason my guy's not like landing on it. Am I, am I just doing it wrong? Okay. I think that I got one. Oh, okay, I got all of them. Okay, cool. Oh god. Okay. I don't know what just happened, but it all worked out. As long as I got my 8 out of 8 for him, <laughs> that's all I care about. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be hopping on mission number 5, Gilding of the Soul. Uh, do I need to buy anything? Nah, I'm probably just going to save it just in case more upgrades come. But let's hop right into it. Also, I want to apologize. I know the last episode's long. And there's probably going to be other longer episodes later on. It just depends how many collectibles and enemies there are to collect their enemy file things. But yeah, let's hop right into this. Oh, okay. It looks like something's happening with that. Bro, we got another shadow. Oh god. Um, actually, I kind of want to switch to shotgun here. Do this. Get out of here. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Can I get one go? No, I can't. Let me down. I'm upset. I didn't mean to like actually exit that. Let me out. Oh, okay, that works. It's also kind of scary because I'm on a time limit right now. Uh, okay. I think we just have to go back to the door that we came from, which I found out last time. We got to go through all this. Hop up here and then. Drop down this little area. I just complete. Oh, I saved it. Let's go. All right, let's go through here. Um. Okay, that was confusing. Head through this door. I think I'm just going down to the bottom because the picture of this level was um the blue doorway that was down here. Oh, I killed it. I guess I'll just kill this thing for. The uh, orbs, you know. Get out of here. Alright, let's go through the door. It's sealed shut by immense power. There's something written. This path will open with a gilding soul. Shall I use the. I don't even want to say it. Melancholy, maybe? I don't know. Oh, okay. <laughs> that was short. Smashing sensation. Let's just see what that is real quick. Achieve an S rank on any mission. Cool. Oh, I got hurt. There's another trophy where you have to complete a mission without getting hurt. This would have been the perfect one if I didn't get hit by shadow. Dang it, man. All right, well, anyways, this was a short mission. Um, There's going to be short missions like this, I guess. And then some that are probably like 40 minutes like the last one. Let's just save this bad boy. Alright. Next mission. Anyways, that will do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to hop on mission number six, Evil of the Waterways. Let's get right into it. I always forget this game just throws you into the level. There's no like cutscenes. Um, I just want to see if there's anything in here. Oh nope. Okay, it's just bringing me back there. All right, let's head this way real quick. Um, I'm trying to look for where the blue. Or fragment is it's above somewhere where there's a crack in the wall just gotta find out where I 
Okay, so that's from where you start. Head to the right, so maybe it's just forward. Where there's a crack in the wall. Oh, there it is. Cool. Alright. Let's continue now. Now we gotta figure out where we actually go. There were uh, multiple doors over here, so... I guess we just try each door. Um... Big room. Looks like there's nothing here, though. Got a rusty key, though. Alright. Got new enemies here. The different colors. There are actually a lot of them. Oh god, I'm stuck. Let me out. Oh god. Okay, blue ones can all die. We want that to happen. Have it eat the maggots off the ground. Okay, how many do I have right now? Four out of six. We got one, two, three, four. Okay, we need five and six. Which shouldn't be too hard. I need to shoot one with a shotgun to flip it on its back. Which I think I just did. And I face away from one until it attacks me by grabbing me. Which I think it's trying to do. Come on, grab me. There we go. That's what I wanted. There we go. That should be good. Okay, yeah, six out of six. A lot of these you kind of just get from doing, like, fighting with them normally. Some of them you kind of have to let them, like, get you. One of them was to flip them on their back, by the way, with the shotgun. I don't know if I said that. And one of them is to let the green ones uh, come over to, like, these little maggot piles for after you kill them. And the green one will eat them. Alright, just to double check that I got all those, even though I just checked. Six out of six. Alright, now we gotta figure out what we have to do with this uh, rusty key. There were, what, two doors ahead of this? Oh god. I did not have my hand on my controller. Or my left hand, at least. Oh, cough. What is this? Give me the red orbs. Give me a wall. Okay, I was actually kind of curious if it was going to break or not. Okay, let's just try to get through here without getting hit by anything. That's a cool little secret uh, tunnel there. Okay, so there should just be one more door left. Actually, probably shouldn't just front run away from these guys. We should get the orbs. Uh, that's good enough. <laughs> I don't want to have to run through all of them again. Alright, use the rusty key. This is a very, like, strange, like, sewage system or waterways, whatever it's called. Is this another one? That was kind of a waste if those were just health. I could have come back for those. Alright, we're going to be coming up on another fight with a new enemy. Um, hopefully I don't, I didn't need that health. Do I have a... Yeah, uh, Beetle Star, and then do I have two of these? I don't remember if I had one before the big fight. What are these? Oh god. Okay, one for this is just to like... Okay, I thought I was gonna have to get hit by that, but I guess not. I got one, two, and four, it looks like. All right, there's like three more to do real quick. Did I just get him? Oops. 
Okay, I got a couple of them, not quite all of them just yet. All right, I need to do that again, but hit it with my sword. Did that do it? All right, I keep checking this. I know this is like not good for like watching, but I have to get all these. All right. Where is he at? Oh God. I think I got some just from that move alone. Seven. Okay, so I just need the la these last two. All right. Where's this guy at? Come on, buddy. Let me get the last couple things for you. I need his head to turn red. That's what I'm waiting for. Come on, dude. Oh god, I just got stuck. That was unfortunate. Dude. I need to use this. I didn't want to waste it on this fight, but... Also, I want to check this again real quick. Oh, I got him all. I can just kill him. Okay, I think it's when he's in this day is when you're supposed to do the sh shoot him with the shotgun to get the last enemy file. Thankfully, I already had them. Okay. I'm gonna save it this way real quick. Just so I don't lose that. And just to be 100% sure, I clicked the right one. Okay, yeah, nine. Alright, now we can continue this level. And grab whatever this is and gilding light a key that shines and and or ardor whatever <laughs> it slowly drains the power of the possessor oh that does not sound good all right well that's that mission not too long not too hard just a few uh enemy files we had to get but uh yeah that will do for this episode if you enjoyed please feel free to leave a like comment and subscribe thank you for watching What's up everybody, welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number 7, holding the Key of Ardor. But first, we're going to head into here and grab another one of these, just so we have it. I'm kind of wasting a lot of red orbs this play through getting that, but... I kind of want to try- I'm trying to get the trophy where you have to play through the whole game without using one of the yellow orbs, which means I can't die. So, yeah. Alright, so I'm constantly getting hurt. And I'm pretty sure all I gotta do is get back to the main area. But before I do that, there is a secret mission that will give you a blue orb. Oh, I just got really turned up. And this guy's back. Cool. Let's just do this again. Really good way of getting this guy. You get a lot of extra like damage jumping off of the wall and attacking. I don't even know if I went the right way. I might have passed the door. No, it was this way. It's kind of unfortunate that I... Okay, cool. I got some health back there, actually. Okay. Once we're back in this room, we're going to head through the door on the right side over here where we got the key in the last level, and that should start a secret mission. Oh, God. Which I'm actually going to... Oh, that's not good. Save it real quick, just in case I collected something there. 
I don't know if I did or didn't, but yeah. Secret mission. All you're going to want to do is get one of the enemies to kill the other enemy for you, pretty much. Which I don't think is too hard. Okay, so first we just got to lock on. Ow, he just smashed me. Get him to do that. And then that. And I think we already got all the files there. Yeah, okay, you get one just for locking on, you get one for having it shoot like the rock things at you, and then you get one for just attacking them in general. Okay, like I said, you, you kind of want these guys to hurt each other, so I'm just going to stay in the middle here and hope they keep shooting their little rock things. Ow. I don't want to stand far enough to where they keep doing that little jump thing, though. Now we use this just to get some health back. There we go. So he just killed his buddy. Which means I can just kill this guy. I'm pretty sure that's all it is, right? Hmm, that's weird. Okay, attempt number two with this. I don't know if I hurt one on accident, because I'm pretty sure they have to hurt each other. My guy can't do any damage, so... Bro! Stop jumping at me, please! Okay, that's not working. Dude, I cannot see. Some of these camera angles are just bad. Ow. I kind of have to use this. Come on, buddies. Keep attacking each other. Please. Not like that. Okay, did that do it? Okay, there we go. That one did it. Let's go! Alright. Now we can just finish this guy off. Ow. Dude, this freaking camera angle is like screwing me over. There we go. Alright, let's head out of here. Now we can just finish the mission. There shouldn't be any other, like, collectibles or... ...secret things or anything else for us to do. Alright. Run this way! Dang it, dude. I kinda wish I knew where I was going right now. Like, am I just going back through here? Oh, I have to kill these guys. Whoops. All right. Okay, doors open now. I still don't know where I'm going though, so that's kind of a problem. <laughs> Alright, 
that's already done. I'm actually kind of worried because I have no idea where I'm trying to go right now. Okay, cool. Okay, I picked the right place. <laughs> I was so worried. <laughs> Alright, let's just head through this door and I think that might be mission complete. Yeah. Alright, cool. Not too bad of a mission. But anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Okay, that was kind of weird. I'm just gonna jump across here. I don't know if I'm on level 8 right now or not. What happens when I go in here? Okay, there we go. Now I'm ending the video. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're gonna hop on to mission number 8, The Legendary Knight Returns. Let's get right into it. Alright, so we're in this room. I already bought the green star thing just because i figured we need it we've needed one like almost every mission by now so uh yeah let's hop on through here and i believe in this mission we get another uh, weapon or another gun so that's exciting just looking around here seeing if there's anything to collect He's back! Alright, here's where you get the last uh, enemy file for this guy. Oh god. Get back here! Okay, we want to get this guy in the red, I believe. Okay, let's try not to get hit by that. Okay, I think that was it. I could be wrong. Okay, cool. We have him complete now. Get him! Okay, that hurt. I'm gonna do this just to be safe. I probably could just finish him, but... Run away! Okay, I would have been totally fine if I didn't use that.
incredible power. Alright. Got a good amount of orbs there. Um, I believe the only... Oh, that's how I meant. The only enemy that we need now that I don't remember is this guy. Dude, I'm kind of upset that I used the healing. <laughs> Alright. Anyways, let's uh, save this just so we have that... Uh, what's it called? Enemy file on Phantom complete. And now we can continue. Get the trident. And then for the next blue orb fragment, I believe it's right up there, yeah. Which if I can... No, don't want to go down there. Yet at least, I don't know if we have to. Alright, here it is. Alright, and that is one full blue orb. So we get another health upgrade. Let's go. Alright. So from here, we continue on. That would have sucked if I actually fell down here <laughs> and missed that blue orb. I would have had to uh, redo this uh, mission. Or at least that fight. It's not like crazy bad. And if you come over here to the skeleton, there is a weapon in his uh, lap. He's holding on to something. Grenade gun. Fires exploding shells of shrapnel. Shrapnel. <laughs> Extremely destructive. Sorry, I suck at uh, reading. All right. Now, I saw something over here. Do we interact with this or what? A strong downward force may help move the lever. Oh, cool. Let the bridge down. I wonder if that means we're almost done with this castle, because I actually have no idea if the whole game takes place in this castle or not. Hello? You just interact with it. <laughs> okay, we're back here. I was here in, I think, the first level. There are three openings to us or something. Ch yeah. I definitely don't think the whole game takes place in this castle, because I feel like I've been to most of the rooms and done most of the stuff necessary. Okay. Hey. What's happening? Oh, you can just jump around. Oh, is this timed? Is that what that is? Go, go, go! I should probably hurry up. Not fight everything. Go, go, go! Nope, it's through this door. No, I missed it. Let me through! Okay. Well, now we know. That's where we go. I just need to not get distracted by the enemy and just go straight for it. Alright. Screw you, buddy. You made me lose that. This is their time. The charm. I don't know why I just said it like that. That was stupid. Dude, stop getting turned around, buddy. Go, go, go. Okay, I got it this time. And then I believe the third fragment is right here. Or second fragment of this level. All right. Now with that, we could head through these doors. Alright, and it looks like that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number 9, New Strength. Let's get right into it. Alright. So the last mission, we brought down this bridge, so now we're going to head across. 
<laughs> and it goes up. Oh, now we're stuck over here. Although there's... Whatever this is. And there's something over there? That's kind of far. Alright. So, we also got uh, this last time. So I'm going to equip that. Just to try it out, you know. One thing I really like about this game is that you have infinite ammo. <laughs> Alright, um... Anything? There's a shop right there. We don't really need it. I already, uh... Bought myself before I started this mission. So let's head on down. It's a big staircase. Alright, let's head out the door. Alright, looks like we got help out there. Oh, book one. That was not expecting that to pop up right there. Alright, so we got. Okay. Ah. Dude, I keep trying to like shoot them and then do that. Okay, there we go. Okay. Let's check our fire real quick. If you guys don't know, if you're like new to this like series, I'm trying to get all of these uh enemy files for the trophy. So it looks like we got one and three or four probably. Alright, that's uh three. So Come on, dude. Did that count? I have to like blast one with the grenade gun and then downward strike him. Okay, looks like we got 10. Okay, so I still need to shoot one with that and then do that. Bruh. Please just let me get it. Okay, I need to like respawn these guys. So hopefully it'll actually let me. Yeah, I need to respawn them. So let's head back in here and then back out. I also have to hit one. Hit one of their shields with um, this. Dude, come on. I think I got the shield thing though. Okay, yeah. Got the shield one. I need to get out of this area. Dude. Please tell me that I got it. Dude, why is that not working for me? Okay, so I have... One, two, three, four, and ten. Okay, I wonder if I could like jump. No, okay. Did that work? Please give me it. Okay, no, I didn't. Also, why is that guy so much bigger? Dude, why is that not getting it? Okay, I'm probably just gonna like grind this out real quick off camera just so you're not stuck here watching this for 10 minutes. Okay, so of course I get what I was going for like first try after I like pause the recording. Okay, that's another one flinging them up into the air. Hopefully that got it. Yeah, that did not get it, okay. Try with this guy. Okay, I'm gonna collect these for a section. 
Fuck the staff. Please tell me he got that. It did not. Oh, okay. It's because I'm not doing it right. Did I get it? No, it didn't. Yeah, I need to get this thing before I die. If I can get up there. There we go. Is that good? Supposed to be hitting them up into the air and then hitting them while they're in there, but it's not getting it for some reason. Okay, so I ended up getting the one I was trying to get where you launch them up in the air. And now for the last one, actually, I'm gonna save real quick. For the last one, you want your health to get down to red to the point where, like, even your uh, health bar, like the gray area, is red. I just moved. I just like. Come on, guys, hit me. Actually, I'm gonna respawn these guys because I might need them in their normal state. Alright. Don't get me. Now I get hit once by... Like that, I think. Did I get it? I didn't. Come on, hit me. This is why I saved it, by the way, because I might die trying to get it. Please tell me you gave it to me there. It didn't. Dude, what the heck? Why is it doing this? Okay, now get to red again. I might just wait till I'm off screen to do this again. I'll just... Try it one more time on this save, and then I'll probably reload the save. Because I don't... I think I, this is the one I need at least. <laughs> Let me see real quick. Before I like do that again. One, two, three, four... Yeah, it's five. Maybe I need to get hit by this big one or something when I'm in the red. Come on, a little bit more, guys. One more hit. Did that do it? Dude, no, it didn't. What the heck? Okay, I'm probably gonna have to, like, reload. Yeah, okay, I just died there. I have to reload. Okay, I reload and I'm back here, and I looked it up, because apparently, like, some other people have been having the problem. Apparently, you just you want your back to be faced towards them, and it'll be, like, a s certain animation. Maybe, like, the one right there where they, like, jump at you. Although, now they're not even hitting me. Hello? Dude, these guys are bad. I've legit just been standing here. There we go. Did that get it? There we go. Now we got it. Okay, so I'm gonna reload this level again just so I can be full health. Just so I'm not, you know, one hit for the whole time. And I'm gonna save that. So I'll be right back. All right. All right, cool. Now we're back to the actual level for now. Just collect these real quick. And then I'm sure you've been seeing it this whole time, but there's this over here. Yellow orb. 
And then I believe on the other side of the door that we came out of, there is going to be a blue orb fragment. Somewhere over here, at least. Is it up here? This is where blue light is sealed. Okay, I think we just break it then. Oh, we just move it. All right. All right. Now we can actually continue. So I did see that room over there to the left, but then there's also like this pathway down here. I don't know which way is the actual like correct way to go. I'm just going to run here and see if this is just a little room. Okay, so. Okay, so some important stuff in here, which I'm not going to touch yet. Because <laughs> I don't know what it does. Got a door right here. And then this place right here. And then this. Is there anything up top? There is. All right. I'm going to go this way. Oh, I need to pause. I'm getting a call. All right. I am back. All right. Let's head inside here. And we're inside another castle. Let's go. I guess we can just start climbing up and oh, and I just jumped off. Dude, why can't I jump up? There we go. Uh, that's too high. And I guess we'll just start climbing up. See where it takes us. Looks like there's a thing here. Alright, we got a devil star. What about the other side? Oh, I did not mean to even jump on that. Whoops. Was that a secret? Alright, this other side looks like has a yellow orb. Alright, so what exactly are we supposed to do in here? What did I say? The gate must have led to the outside, but it's been destroyed and that means I can't go through. What are those things up there? That's my question. Did I miss something? Or am I just not supposed to be in here yet? Oh! I didn't even see this area. Okay. Oh, wait. Is this gonna bring something out for me to jump across? Go, 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 go. Oh, okay. So I just had to activate these things. Alright. Oh, God. This is not gonna go good. I suck at platforming. Oh god. Okay. Not gonna- Oh god! I almost just screwed it then there. I'm not gonna lie. I'm very surprised I did that on my first try. There's an inscription on the base. The name is Ifrit, I think it said. The fool who awakens me shall pay dearly with the fires of hell. Ifrit, a flaming gauntlet that gives the possessor increased powers. Does that mean it's going to make it easier for me to fight fight things now? Um, actually... <gasps> oh, it's a weapon. I mean, it's slower, but it seems like it kills these guys a lot faster. Yeah, it's definitely slower, like, attacking speed. Dang it, dude. I was kind of hoping it would give me full uh, HP there. Okay, I'm going to pause real quick because I know there's enemies coming out here and I need to look up what the enemy files for them are. Alright, so it looks like most of it is just avoiding all of the attacks that he does. You're going to get 6 out of 9, I believe, for this. Son of 
Sparta challenges the darkness for this. Block off, Featherface, or you can stick around and find out the hard way. Okay, I did not realize this was going to be a uh, boss. Okay, that's two out of however many. Now. Come on, buddy, keep attacking me. Okay. Okay, how many do I have? Dude, okay. That's not good. Okay, let me see how many I have for him right now. Five out of nine. I have one, two, three. And then two. Okay, so we just need seven. I'm going to switch back to... Um, Am I just choosing this? Uh, actually, no. I don't know. Does... I really hope this, like... Kills me. I need to stick close by. to do some kind of talon attack thing so if I stick like close by him he should do it was that it no it wasn't but I should probably save right now just to save the ones we have Come on, buddy, do it. Actually, I might I'm gonna do this just so I don't die. Dude, come on. I don't know how to get him to do this. That was stupid. Come on, buddy, do your talent attack, please, so I can just beat you. Dude, what is that? That was dumb, I just jumped into it. Okay, I might die here. I'm just gonna see if I have it yet or not. I don't think I do, but you know, I don't. Okay, at least these things are landing above. Get him! I really need him to do. Is that it? Please tell me that was it. <gasps> Let's go! I did it finally. Sorry, I'm not. I'm talking a lot about this, but <laughs> I just want to get it done. Okay. Now save, and now we can just beat him.
I don't trust that. Get him! Okay, I guess I can't hurt him now. Come on, don't do this to me. No! That's unfortunate. Dude, I just died. I didn't realize I just died there. Are you kidding me? That sucks. All right, I'll be back. I just totally missed my freaking fight with Griffin this time. Pretty much all I did was use the grenade launcher to shoot him with it. And then using the L1 stuff, his or my new ability, it did a lot more damage to him. So I'm sorry I just missed that. That's a very unfortunate. But, uh, yeah, he is now, uh, defeated. He's not dead, but defeated. But, uh, yeah, anyways, now that I have the stuff I need, I'm assuming I go this way. Either this way, or there's also these doors, but I'm gonna assume is this way. Words are carved here. A pair of flames that dwell with strength will open the path. I just attack it. Oh, wait, 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 is it the fire? Okay, okay. That makes more sense. <laughs> okay. This place is creepy. This place would have scared the crap out of me as a child. Okay. Okay, so for this one, I want to keep my distance and lock on to him. He'll throw some kind of flame thing, I think. Oh god. I didn't realize these guys were here too. It's that guy that I'm trying to... Okay, well, there's that. Alright, that was the first one. Should have oh, oh three. One, two, and then five. Okay, for the last two, I have to stay pretty close to him. Now. I think that was one, actually. Oh, I just pressed one button. Holy crap. I'm just gonna save to get that stuff. I'm gonna use this bad boy just so I don't die. That's not what I want. Whoops. Okay, I want to be close to him, but turn away from him. I need him to grab onto me. Apparently this move though, it doesn't happen often in normal. Like it happens way more often in um, hard mode. Okay, just jump away from that. No need getting hit from stuff. Come on, dude. I want you out of the way. Just do it. Yeah, I kind of knew that one was coming. I just didn't dodge it. He turned? That was BS. Okay.
This is kind of unfortunate. So I'm going to have to redo all this. I actually don't have time for that right now. Yeah, okay. I don't have time for it right now, so I will continue it a different time. So next time you see me, it'll be a uh, refresh. I guess. I don't know. <laughs> Anyways, I'll see you guys in like two seconds for you, but probably a day later for me. All right, so I'm getting back to the spot where I need to uh, get the last two enemy files, and I came back because I was trying to go to the shop, and I ended up getting this trophy. Unfortunately, I did not get it on camera. Um, I don't know exactly how I got it. All I know is I used my L1 thing, the special thing, and then I just started swinging out of the store, so yeah. Anyways, I'll be back once I get to where I was going before. All right, made it back here. Hopefully I can get it this time. I did switch back to Alistar just so I can dodge the attacks a little bit better. Let's see, get rid of some of these guys first. Okay, so one thing I need to be close enough to where he like tries to grab me or something. I don't know. Like, was that it? This level or this mission. Our video is just gonna be long just for me trying to get this freaking enemy file. Okay, so when he like rolls him up like that, I just need to jump. Oh, I need that. Oh god, that might have been it. Was that it? One, two, four, five. Okay, that's not the one I was looking for, but I will save just so I don't have to do that one again. Because that was one of them. Okay, I forgot about the fire. So I know a tip is you want to be like close to him, but just out of reach of his normal like attack. Dude. And then these guys got to come in and ruin it. Oh god. And this is why I needed Alistair on, so I can jump over that stuff. Am I even saying it right? Alistair? Yeah. Okay, did that again. Okay, I'm gonna use this. And he used fire right when I healed. That was unfortunate. I really wish the camera was a little bit better in this area. But then again, it's PS2 area. It's not really known to have the best cameras. I want that. Okay. So I want to be out of range of that attack. Come on, dude. Fire again, and I didn't even get to dodge it. No, that was it. I jumped out of the way. Are you kidding me? I'm so dumb. That was close. Oh, God. I don't even know where he is right now. Did he come back this way? Yep, he did. Okay, I guess I can't just jump straight. 
Oh my god, dude. I I'm gonna freaking die again. I get this point. I should probably just reset. Yeah, okay. I think I finally got it. Thank you, that took forever. Anyways, if you didn't see, he jumped on my back and I had to like shake the uh, left hand logic stick for him to get off. Anyways, now we can actually just beat this guy. If I can. Okay, he's already hurt a little bit. Alright, let's just cancel that, grab this health. Alright, there's this tree stump right here. If I can get on it. There we go. Alright, from here, I think we want to jump over here. Yeah, that ledge up there that we just saw. Get it. I just missed it. This isn't necessary, by the way. This is just for a uh, item. There we go. A holy water, which I guess, from what I've heard, we're going to want these in the hard difficulties. All right, now we can finally move on from this area, though. I'm just happy we got that last uh, fetish uh, enemy file, which that's kind of a weird name, by the way, <laughs> for an enemy. All right, might as well get one of these just so we always have one on us. And we can also upgrade. Might as well just get some of these and that's all we can get for now. Oh, well, we got some upgrades for it, so that's pretty cool. Just save real quick. Not that that really does anything, I get. Yeah, I guess that doesn't really do anything for the upgrade, but oh well. Can I break these? Ooh. Stay down, buddy. All right, yeah, that's not too bad. I actually wonder what's better. Oh, yellow orb. Okay, cool. All right. Let's just keep shotgunning this guy until he dies. We can hit him a couple times too. Okay, cool. And then that, this I think. Yeah. Okay. Cool. Up here, there's this thing that we could break. Would you get a lot of red orbs from? Let's go. I don't want those to disappear. All right, cool. And then I'm sure you saw on this side, there's this hidden item right here. All right, now we can hop on down and finish fighting these guys. Actually, there's a lot. Um, might be in our best interest to switch to the other thing, Ifrit, 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 how do you say it? And then do this, and just start punching the crap out of these guys. Oh yeah, that's so much stronger. Oh yeah, dude. Two, three, four, yeah, four hits and they're dead. That's so good. Oh, these guys just infinite spawning? What the heck? No! Get him! Okay, at least they give, like, a lot of health, it seems like. Alright, cool. Is that it? Are you open now? use 200 red orbs oh okay at least they gave us that fight to actually get orbs to open that i could have been screwed there all right just to refresh just gonna go through all these make sure we have everything we need not that we can get some of these anyways in the level but these two we're gonna finish later 
We're going to finish that one later. That's done. And that's done. Cool. All right. Let's head on through here. Assuming this is the end of the level, at least. <laughs> All right. Cool. All right. Well, bird of prey. Let's go. Let's see. 9.5. Alright, sorry, just doing stuff on the side to uh, keep track of all the trophies I get. Alright, definitely saving after that, because that was a lot of annoying stuff to do. Not that the level is hard or anything, but, you know. Alright, that'll do for this episode, though. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number 10, Cannon of Mist. Let's get right into it. All right. Don't know how long this one's going to be. Uh, there's not really any collectibles, like trophy-wise, for this mission, so it might be fast. We'll see. Just get rid of all these guys. Oh, this is one of the more annoying guys. There we go. I'm gonna try my best to get through this mission without getting hurt, just because that is a trophy. Man, it's already not gonna happen. I already ruined that. All right, let's just go. Actually, no. We want the red orbs. I need to upgrade stuff, so. Ow. Let's just do this. And boom. Easy. I like how I say that I'm going to try not to get hurt, and then immediately after I just get hurt. Good timing. Some kind of strange power has taken me back to something. I guess I'll have to try again. So is it like a whole pick the right path kind of thing? All right. Let's just get you out of here. Do all the green ones like let out health? I've been kind of wondering that. Does he let out health? No. It must just be random then. All right. We're back here, so I think we just go back. So my first thought was right then, to go right. I just turn around to kill everything and then, yeah. I'm just gonna run past all these guys, to be honest. It's a riddle of some kind, a valley of the mist. One must choose the right path to enter the lost land. Only those who protect the weak light shall out of power and decide for the right path. But dude, sorry, I am terrible at reading. Get out of here. All right, let's just go. I wonder if that was just kind of a sign, right? Some kind of strange power has taken me back to the entrance. Is it just random? Do I have to like go backwards? Like, do I just turn around? Or does it, is it just random every single time? No, okay. It must just be random. Or I have to kill everything for the right path. I don't know. But I guess we'll just fight. Get out of here. Let's have to follow the orb, because last time it like started moving after I interacted with it. Get out of here. Okay, and you should be almost done. Alright. Oh, you missed. Well, let's use the right path. Okay. Okay. Someone this way this time. 
So, is that the whole secret? Okay, yeah, I think I'm just following this thing. Okay, this guy just like took it from me. He needs to come back. Let the light out, please. There we go. Okay, so that one's going left. Just trying to collect my orbs before I move on. I could have totally finish this mission without getting hurt. Kind of annoys me that I got hit. I could always just restart. Break the shields. Hot as hell, let's go. Alright, so that's the other uh, S rank uh, combo thing, which we got the other one. Or I got the other one off screen. I had to like start a recording to get it. Okay, which way did this thing go? Did, the, did it go this way? I don't see it. How about this way? Bruh, where'd he go? Did I miss something over here? Well, this is unfortunate. I'm just gonna guess. Yeah, I don't see it anywhere. That is annoying. Is that right? Or is that reset? Let's go, I guess right. Get him! Dude, can I get close to you, please? That was annoying. Okay. Uh, there's this thing over here. Okay, holy water. I think that's the only collective in this game, or in this uh, mission. Do I need that? No, I didn't, but all well. Is there anything on the side? Oh, another one of these guys. Get out of here. Okay. Let's just grab this and we should be able to move on. Oh, I had to kill the, both of them. Okay. All right, that's mission cleared. And I got a C rank, unfortunate. I'm kind of curious how that works. Like if you just don't get hit or something. Anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing Mission 11 called Fate. Let's just hop in here. Do I have enough to buy any of this? I can. But I'm not going to, actually. I don't want to have, like, no red orbs just in case we need to buy a door or a uh, heal thing. Alright. Uh, we can go right back through here. And it should start a secret mission. Alright, let's hop right in here. To do this one, actually, we need to switch to uh, Alistar. Because we need the uh, double jump stuff. And then, I believe it's just right up there. Oh. Okay. There we go, got it. You have to, like, jump off their heads and then use your double jump thing in the air to grab it. All right, let's just grab that. 
You don't have to kill these guys, but I'm just going to for the orbs. Get him! This camera change is weird. Alright, last one. I was kind of hoping it would give me health there. Alright. Uh, I left a couple orbs there, but it's fine. It's just a few. Let's go! Another trophy! Alright, so next up... Once we get back in here, there's gonna be a new enemy. Oh, I didn't let me do that. And... Is he already in here? He is not. Alright. Uh, I think he was supposed to do something there. Okay. That had to unlock him. It didn't for some reason. Why is he not unlocking? Bruh, what is happening? Is he unlocked yet? There we go. Now he's unlocked. So we got one, three, and seven. All right. So in order to get another one, I'm just going to go into here and then back in the door because we want him to spin around us pretty fast. And it says that he normally does this initially. Which he didn't do it this time, actually. So we're just going to keep doing it until he does his weird spinny thing. Did that do it? It did not. Alright, let's just do this again until it does its stupid attack that it needs to do. It just keeps saying if it doesn't do it initially, then just keep like... Going in and out. Just do that before it attacks. Dude, I don't know why it's not doing it. We want to get his health low, by the way, for one. Ow. Okay. Did not mean to come up here, but I will. Come on, buddy. I'm waiting for him to like summon stuff. Some of his attacks like summon things. Okay, we're gonna have to use this, unfortunately. That's one of them. I think. Okay. Oh, we got all seven. Right? Yeah, we got all seven. Cool. Alright, now we should be able to just fight him. Oh, he's only one hit. Okay. Good thing we didn't kill him then. Because one of the entries... I don't know which one, actually. Let me check. I think it's five. You have to... You can only get when he's, like, right about to die. Or really low in health. All right, let's just collect this thing. Another Devil Star. Up over here, get this red orb. And there should be a blue orb somewhere around here. All right, just did a quick little save. Okay, we see a blue orb down there. How do we get in there though? Did I just like miss it? 
Oh, okay. I think I just missed it. Or not. How do you get in here? Let me see. Does it have to do with that thing? Ooh. Don't miss that. How do I get those? There's another one right there, actually. Come on, let me around here. There we go. Okay, this one we could just jump down. Let's go straight through here. Grab this bad boy. Alright. Regardless, that should get us four out of four. I'm still kind of curious about that other side, though. Hey, we got a health upgrade. Let's go. How do we get out of here? Just jump up here? Okay. Is there anything else down here? No. Okay, let me check this other side real quick. I could always jump down there. That is one, right? Or is that something else? That might not actually be one. <clears throat> Just double check there's no holes in the glass up here. There is not. Alright, can I go through here? Um, anything interesting? Is that stairs over there? So confusing. This whole map in this game is so cool, by the way. I haven't really like, said anything about it, I don't think, but... Words are inscribed. Chalice shall open the gate to the dark path. Okay, we can't do that yet. But yeah. As I was saying, this map is really cool. <laughs> really big castle. I feel like it's like a... Uh, what's it called? Like Demon Souls kind of game? Dark Souls, that's what it's called. <laughs> just instead of like being open world, it's like just a set map. Alright, uh, I'm not gonna jump off that because I don't want to walk back up the stairs. Where are you taking me? What? Was I supposed to, blah, 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 blah. Was I supposed to jump off somewhere? I need to get in there somehow. There's a hole in the ground. Like, am I going down there? This is where the star was. Oh, well, I just jumped straight into that. Okay. Get out of here. I wonder if I should go back to uh, Ifri for now. Give me your souls or orbs. I guess it's not really your soul. It's a statue, which means I can buy another one of these. All right, let's just break this open. Oh. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. This might be a good area for this. Okay, yeah. Keep him in the corner. At least this doesn't hurt me. Okay. Okay. That went pretty good, actually. A lot better than what I thought was gonna go. Top up here.
Okay, here's this thing. Sign of chastity. Okay, so that's what I needed to get inside the other room. Oh, it's back. Get out of here. Oh, I didn't mean to go back up here. Whoops, I meant to just jump over that guy. That's unfortunate. I'm, too, I'm gonna try to get out of this area just so that doesn't happen again. Stay there. Okay, yeah, good farming spot. Are they dead? Let's go. Okay, now where am I going? Oh, here's a blue orb. Let's go. I believe that's all the collectibles in this mission, though, so. I don't think we need to try to find any more. I almost wonder if I should, like, switch back to my gun. I don't know which one is, like, the best one. I like how much damage the grenade launcher does, but it's just so slow at shooting. I think a shotgun's a good, like, in-between between this and the uh, pistols. But I, th I do think we get a, uh... A, uh... What's it called? What am I thinking of? A gun? <laughs> After this mission? Like, next mission? Ooh, what's that? There's another heal thing up there. Okay, so if I wanted to, I could go back up there and jump across, I think. A chalice. The cup which held the blood of the divine dead. Uh-oh. Uh, I'm switching weapons. Hold on. And then I almost think I should switch to this. I wonder if this actually does like decent damage or not like now. Get out of here. Let's go. I don't think he's like completely gone though. Words are inscribed. The chalice shall open the gate. What are you talking about? Didn't I just put that down? Oh, I don't have my double jump right now. I was wondering why I couldn't uh, jump up here. Do I have to interact with this thing again, maybe? I've already got the child's time to move on. Did I miss something? Enter the seal, so I guess I can't go back this way. Okay. So there was a reason for that. Okay, 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 that makes sense. I just skipped that accident. Should I use the child's? Sure.
open the doorway. I'm sorry you guys gotta deal with me if you're watching this. <laughs> Saying stupid crap. Alright, mission cleared. Let's go. Broken Halo. Let's go. Sorry, I gotta mark this down real quick. Boom, boom. And there we go. I gotta mark down all my trophies that I get. Alright, but that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help me out, and I would really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing Mission 12, Ghost Ship. Let's get right into it. Underwater controls, change direction, up, down, inverse, change direction, check, swim. When you have the underwater gun equipped, R1 square or okay, so it's normal controls then. I didn't even think this game had underwater stuff, so that's pretty cool. Oh, just hiccuped. All right, still not gonna upgrade anything just yet. <clears throat> Get out of here! I know who you are. All right. Break you. Oh, you're not working yet. Dude, how much health do you have? Okay. Get out of here. Once again, I'm so glad this game does not have like a limited amount of ammo. Otherwise, I'd be out. Uh, looks like we got another one of these. Just hit it until it breaks. Give me the red orbs. I'm curious how many of these actually hold. It's probably just like a hundred or something. I didn't really count. Um, I know it said underwater. Does it want me to just go straight underwater right now? Ooh, whoa, whoa, whoa. <laughs> what is happening? That was so weird. Okay, I get it now. Do I not have an underwater weapon that I can use? Will these work? No. Does the grenade launcher work, maybe? What is happening? Okay, I don't think I can actually do anything in the water right now. Oh god. Let me go! Okay, this thing wants to attack me. Where am I going? There's supposed to be chests in here. So that's what I'm kind of looking for right now. Is that it? Okay, that is it. Okay, got that. Uh, we kind of need to let this guy just like attack us, unfortunately. So we should probably save real quick. Because for one of the enemy files, it needs us to be in the red. And we get one just for kind of like seeing this guy. And once we get in the red, he should do like a the spin attack, which is what we want to see. Come on, buddy, I'm right here. Do I need to be further from you? Okay, I'm probably gonna pause until I get low health because this is probably gonna take a while. Oh, I probably should let me hit. Let it hit me one more time. We're almost there, though. This is taking forever. Probably like five minutes, to be honest. Go, go, go. Did I just leave? Whoops. Okay, I should be full, low health though, still. Okay, so this guy should do some kind of spin move on me. That's unfortunate. Oh, that sucks. He killed me. That's what I was looking for though. I'm gonna have to sit through all that again.
I need this guy to stay away from me. Oh, I did not mean to come out here, but did he try to when I was unlocking? No, he didn't. Come on, buddy, do your spin thing. Why is he trying to get so close to me? <laughs> Come on, buddy, do your spin thing. Kind of annoying waiting for him to do it. Come on, dude. Okay, well, you guys saw, so I might just do this off screen. Okay, so he finally did it, and I swam straight up, and I ended up up here without knowing where I was going, so yeah. Okay, so just save that just so we have it. Nothing in this treasure chest thing. Oh my god. Holy crap. Okay, let's just do this real quick, just so we don't die. I mean, I guess that was kind of a waste. I could have just, like, reloaded this whole area. On. You can see the next gun right there. Go get him with the sword. Okay, cool. All right, next gun is going to be right here. All right, and then same spot. We get another devil star. Let's go. Let's head up the stairs. All right, before we do anything. Where is the front mass? Is this it? I don't think that's it. I think there might be one more. Is there? Yeah, okay, there's one more. This one might be a little bit annoying. Hopefully it's not. We want to get to the very tip top of this thing. And we want to do something like this. Okay. Use your stinger move and it'll launch you over here. If you don't know how to do that, it's just R1 and triangle with Alistair. Alright, let's just make our way back over here. I know there's these red orbs everywhere, but like... I really don't want to be <laughs> jumping everywhere to collect them. Because they're only like five, I think. So like I could probably get like... 30, 40, maybe 50 around here. Okay, let me just save this real quick. And then, how do I break this open? I'm the ship that carries the wandering souls on the brink of the underworld. Protect the ship and you shall be given the fire of Saint Elmo. What does that mean? Okay. Ow. Get over here. Bro, what is happening? Can this guy just come over here so I can hit him?
Come over here. Now. Come here. Okay, this guy should be almost dead, right? Ow. There we go. Give me health, please. Thank you. Oh, he gave me full health. Let's go. Just what I needed. Now we open. Okay, looks like I get round number two with this guy. Um, isn't uh this better for this fight? And then also switching my gun. That's I just hit a bunch of buttons. I did not mean to hit grenade launcher. Whoa! Okay. Ow. Okay, buddy. Bro! Don't attack that one, dude. Okay, this fight's annoying. Does it just want me to stay up there? Dude, I don't know what to do here. Uh, let me check this real quick because I think I've gotten the two that I can get here. Yeah, okay. So I'm going to save if I can. Okay, cool. That was a weird fight. I'm going to save this real quick. Now that I can. And I just want to be 100% sure. Just because I don't want this to end if I don't have it. Okay, 8 out of 9. Cool. Open the door. Alright, mission cleared. Cold turkey. Let's go. What am I looking for? All right, that will do for this episode, though. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.
<clears throat> Alright, sorry, I had to clear my throat there. A uh, staff of Hermes, let's go. We're sinking. Okay, so we already have that equipped. Um, so this can falling up net, and they can be used underwater. Okay, so cool. Good to know. Okay. So to start out, we want to exit this area through here. Wait, what's this? Can I go through here? Okay. Get him! I wonder if this could be used like outside of water too. Ow. Actually, I want to go for that stuff real quick. Okay, turn around. This guy's probably following us. Get out of here! Let's go. Okay, I'm gonna pause real quick because the blue orb is somewhere around here. Okay, so I believe it's this one because it says go down the hole below the stairs. Yeah, okay. Ow. I'm just gonna go for this real quick. All right. Now we got to around deal with these guys. Or is this multiple or just this one? Go, 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 go. Okay, cool. So it says for this next one, it's going to be a secret mission. So it says it wants you to go back to the captain's headquarters before you finish this level. So I don't know if I've done enough for that yet. Where am I going? Right here. And then it wants you to interact with the captain's body. Okay, so I haven't done what I need to do yet. Also, I think this is a missable uh, mission, so you should probably save beforehand. Sorry, I'm not like a pro of this game. I'm kind of reading all this stuff off of a little uh, missable trophy guide, so. Oh god, I feel like I'm going to sneeze. Okay, turn around. Alright, I'm gonna pause real quick. Alright, I don't know why I always announce when I'm gonna pause. It's not like it uh, takes off for you guys. It's literally like a split second between me pausing and then resuming the video. I just jam right into that, cool. Go, go, go. Okay. No. I don't know if... Crap. Okay, cool, cool, cool. So in this area, before you, like, actually, uh... Start mission 14, we can turn around. Yeah, that was a little scary. Get 
Get him! They respawn. Is this other guy still alive? Yeah, he is. I'm probably just wasting time doing this. I don't think I have to uh, re-kill these guys. Okay. Head up these stairs. I guess it gives us orbs though. Are these guys still here? No, they're not. All right, go into here. And now we should be able to interact with Mr. Captain right here. Secret mission. Eliminate all enemies. Go, go, go. Ow. I'm just gonna sit here and do this. I already got two. Get him! Yeah, this isn't too hard at all. It's much easier when they come closer. Okay. Spam! Okay, he's under me. Okay, I'm doing a little bit of damage to all of them. I can't even just focus on one though. Okay, there's one. Alright, one more. Where's this guy at? I think he was under me. Wait, did I just see him? There he is. He's trying to run away. Look at you. I know he's coming towards me, never. Let's go! Alright. Oh, and that's 4 out of 4. We get another uh, health upgrade. Let's go. Secret mission cleared. All right, now we should be able to just go to like the exit area that we were at before. Just curious, how many red orbs do I have right now? 2,600? Not bad, not bad. All right, let's just head over here. Luckily, these guys don't spawn again. The guys down here might spawn again. They did last time when I came back in. Yeah, okay. Okay, I'm gonna focus on this guy to the right over here. I like I went to hiding. Oh, wrong way. Camera's inversed. Alright! Boom, boom, boom. Let's see, I'm kinda curious if I could use it outside of the ship and if it's like strong. Okay, let's head out here. I wonder where we're gonna pop out, because we went on a little bit of a boat ride. Let's just swim up here and hop out. And there's a blue orb right here. Alright, let's get out of here. I kind of think it's weird that they did the whole ending uh, mission thing. They did that in an earlier mission too, where you had to like jump across a gap. Let's just open this up. Nothing. Maybe I need to fight these guys first. There's treasure here, but there's nothing that can be used as a weapon. Okay, here it is. Holy water in this like open chest right here. And then we can collect this stuff. Blow some dudes up up the stairs. And then we can head up the stairs and the ending should be up here, right? I wonder if it actually brought us back to the castle now that I think about it. I don't know. But anyways, that will do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number 14, Deep Darkness and Towering Mountains. Let's get right into it. All right. I'm actually going to switch my gun real quick. I prefer shotgun. I actually prefer the, prefer the handguns, but shotgun does... Oh, okay. 
shotgun does good amount of damage. There's something written. At dusk, when darkness is near, the curtains shall fall. The dance of the bloodthirsty dead. Sorry, I kind of read that kind of weird. As I always say, I suck at reading, so... The iron fence is blocking the way. If it's just iron, I should be able to, like, do this. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to switch those back to Alistair. Which, I mean, that might be a mistake, actually, if I'm going to have to fight here. I probably shouldn't have done that, but oh well. Um, where exactly am I heading? These hallways look like they're going to be, uh, kind of annoying. I'm going to have to dodge all these, I'm sure, while getting pushed by this door. Or this wall. There's something written. The resonating emblem shall undo the seal of the shield. Emblem shield, let's go. Skeleton's arm appears to be a lever of some sort. Sure. And then I run for my life, right? Just, you know, a wild guess. Booby trap. Oh my. This is not really what I was expecting. I thought it was just gonna... Ah, I guess I should have expected this, but... Oh god, like a jumping actually really helps. Ow. Go, go, go. Okay, cool. Now, is there a reason for me to go inside this area again over here? Like, do I speak to you? No, it just says the same thing. Whoops. Did not mean to do that again. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I'm gonna ride, ride the elevator. Bring me up. Okay. Do I need anything from you? No, I don't. Oh wait, I can't even buy this anymore. Am I filled up on that? I don't know if you can actually fill up on it, but like maybe to the point where I can't like buy it. Kind of like how I can only hold one health. Um, I'm looking for something. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Should be able to get up here, right? Boom. Come on, man. Get up there. Am I just like doing something I'm not supposed to? Can I jump up top this one? Why can't I not stand up there? Am I, do I just do this? Yeah, I just do that. Okay, I'm just dumb. Alright. So yeah, I guess I didn't have to you jump on the thing. I read the thing wrong. Okay. Let's head over here. I just totally failed that. Okay. Let's retry that. Oh god. There we go. Hop up here, grab that bad boy. Just climb to the top of here. And we get another thing that we're not going to use to play through. Maybe once we get to a harder one, I don't know. And then we could just jump on down here. And there should be another holy water here. Uh, did that add to that? Okay, yeah, I have six. Okay, let me just read something real quick, just so I don't miss anything. Okay, I'm just gonna continue for a bit. The guide is a little bit confusing, so I'm just gonna play until I hit a certain point that's talking about. And then figure out what I gotta do. Hey, buddies. I haven't seen these guys in a while. Dude, this is very confusing. Are these guys like stronger?
Okay, I'm gonna jump down here. I cannot fight on those ledges. Dude, can I hop down here, please? Oh my god. Stop locking on. I'm gonna have to heal. I didn't want to heal during this fight. I hate this game. Get away from it. Come on, dude. I thought when- Okay, that's what I was waiting for. As I said, I'm pretty sure I saw somewhere like when turns red, that means get away from it. Where you go? Oh. Okay, cool. Okay, this is the point where I need to pause real quick. Alright. So from here, we just continue on through this little caveway. And I think... Oh. Uh. I'm gonna go back in here, because this is not making any sense to me. says something about platforms going up but I don't see any platforms I'm gonna pause and like look this up real quick because I is that what's talking about like there's a get up oh my god dude get up please okay I'm gonna pause real quick all right so I'm kind of confused we come up here, head back out here, jump up here. I don't know what's happening, man, okay? The thing I saw, they like jumped across there. So I'm just very confused on what's happening right now. Just get rid of these guys. Dude. How can you go from being flinched to just blocking? There we go. Come on, give me my orbs. Okay, so what we're looking for, I have no idea to be honest. Like, is it this? Is this what it wanted me to do? Oh, uh, okay, okay, okay. Platforms, let's go. Okay, so yeah, this is the right way. My bad. Okay, this is the ledge I was trying to jump to from over there. So we can come over here and we can break this thing real quick. Okay, so if we hit 2,900, then this gives us 100. Which I think that's exactly what it gives us, actually. Or at least just under it, I don't know. Okay, and then jump down here, and boom, right there. Okay, now we can actually continue. Let's head through here. I already killed these enemies, already opened up this door, so let's head right inside here. Actually, you know what? For this fight, let's just switch to you.
Get out of here. Okay, I don't know why he's attacking that way. Because I was 100% holding down on my analog stick and he's still attacking like towards the top of the screen. Get out of here. Okay, just get rid of that guy real quick. Don't want to fight him. Okay. And then we could probably just jump up here, right? Switch back. So we can have our double jump. Definitely prefer this just because of the double jump. Although, if it is not bad for fighting. I apologize if I'm butchering that name, by the way. Ifrit, Ifrit, Ifrit. I don't know. Uh, is there anything up here? This is like the same room that we were in that before. Just mirrored. Like when we had to fight a bunch of the, uh, uh, fetish guys. <laughs> so weird calling them that. Okay. Seven, 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 twelve, nine, seven, eight, six, seven, three. You still need three, but we haven't fought you again yet. I mean, we did, but nothing to like get that up. Ten, eight out of nine, which means he's not done yet. Okay, so it's just the two boss people that we're not like done with. You can't grab me, hand. And I, I can break in here. Nope. Orbs, let's go. Whoa. I wonder if we're like almost back to the castle now. You have unsealed it. All right, mission clear. Let's go. All right, I really need to find a mission that I can beat without getting hurt. Otherwise, that's going to be like the last mission or last uh, trophy for me to do. Anyways, that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing Mission 15, Wheel of Destiny. Let's get right into it. All right. So to begin, we're going to backtrack a little bit. Uh, we are trying to get back to the elevator that we went up last mission. And I got hit. That's unfortunate. So yeah, it's going to be kind of far. I think it's going to be out here. And then we climb up this mountain. Head back inside here. All right. Uh, actually, I want to make sure I have everything I need. Okay. I think we're good. And I can't up upgrade anything yet. Let's hop on top of this bad boy if I can, like, you know, move. Yeah, is there a reason I can't get on this? Thank you. <laughs> that was kind of weird. It wasn't letting me, like, move when I jump. Alright, from here, hop out and then head to the right over here. And I believe we talked to this thing. There's something written. At dusk when darkness is near, the curtains shall fall. The dance of the bloodthirsty dead. And we get secret mission. Alright, let's hop right into this mission. Oh, okay. I guess we're fighting shadows again. Um, which, I don't know what I have equipped. Oops, I didn't have me click that one. I'm going to click this one. Actually, which one is better? I don't know. Okay, I wanted to come back in here. Ah, uh, wait, wait, wait. Oh god, they're all here. Come on. 
I don't want to be out here. Okay, I think I forgot that one. I might actually try to switch to this real quick. See how good this does against them. Ow. Oh god, get away. Okay, I really need to heal. It, it didn't let me pause. Are you kidding me, game? Okay, I'm gonna reset. Okay. That was unfortunate. Dude, are you kidding me again? Okay, so I found out a better strat. Let's use the pistols. I'll just go ham on these guys. Okay, this guy should be almost. Okay, yeah, there we go. Boom. Okay, so he's good. If I can just like not get hit by him, you know, he's gonna blow up from this probably. Yep. Get him. Ow. I hate it when they're off screen. Dude, come on. Okay. Get him. Okay, now I just need dodge. There we go. Okay, finally got it. Oh, that's uh, our fourth one. So we get another health upgrade. Let's go. Okay. Now we can head back to where we're supposed to go. Your mission cleared. Let's go. Not gonna lie, that one was annoying just because you're in like such a small, confined place. But we made it through. And I didn't even use my uh, star to heal. Let's go. And I just want to see how much of this stuff I have. I know, like, you're gonna want a lot of items for your uh, Dante Must Die playthrough. Just because everything is so hard. Dude, they throw more of these guys at me. Come on. Run away. I know a lot of people recommend to play through this game a couple times on normal mode just to kind of like grind out those uh, items. I did not mean to just run back through there. Run away. Okay. I also know you can like kind of just skip a lot of enemies in Dante Must Die mode, which makes it pretty nice. It's just the boss fights are kind of anno annoying. I also know you can like uh, skip the first like, Griffin fight, which is pretty nice too, just because that's one less annoying fight. I think we're going here. Yeah. I guess it could have been that other shield too. I think there's another one like the opposite side. All right, just looking around. Mysterious stone that shines in the dark. Hmm, interesting. 
Alright, let's hop down here. Ooh. Okay, I need to switch. Hold up. Let's get E freed out. And just destroy these guys. It's so much easier with this thing. Oh, whoops. Get him! Alright. So we got a shop right there. We got doors to the right side, and we just destroyed this. Let's just destroy everything in here. I think I saw a blue orb. I know there's one around here somewhere. Am I wrong? Oh, it's just right there in the middle of the room. What's this? Oh, holy water. Okay. Alright. Let's head through the store and see where it takes us. Oh, 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 oh holy crap. Go, go, go. This is gonna be... Oh my god, that was close. Um, is there anything in here? Oh god. Words are inscribed. Sacrifice becomes magical powers and rise country power to the sky wall. Dude. What do I do? Dude, I don't know if I can fight these guys here. Let me just switch guns real quick. They'd probably be better with this. Shotgun is definitely better for these guys. Oh, what was that? Did you hit me? Um. Okay, I don't know what's going on. Let's just continue this way. I'm actually gonna switch to uh, Alistar for now, just so I can get my double jump and get through here faster. Go, go, go. Oh god. That was close. Oh. Get out! Okay, made that. Okay, cool, cool. Something written. I see him entrust the conqueror with the lands. The time has come to open the door. Oh, that was my bad. Okay, do I do anything here? I already read through that. Dude, what is this? I don't know. Let's just head back. Oh, I almost ran straight into that. Go, go, go. Okay, let's just skip these guys. I like how those guys were so annoying during that first fight. I mean, I guess that's just because I was trying to get the en enemy files, but. Why was it shining up in the sky? Okay. Ow. Give me your orbs, please. All right. There's a decoration resembling two knights. It appears as though the knight should be holding something where it's a card beneath the decoration. The shields that glow with light and pair of lance shall lead to the better. Yeah. Um. Okay, I don't know if I was supposed to go in here. Whatever that is. I don't think I was supposed to go in here. 
I'm gonna pause real quick. All right, I made it back to this point. I'm gonna see if I can go through this door real quick. There's an emblem shield. Yeah, okay, cool. I did not want to miss this stuff. Because this stuff is probably missable if I had to guess. All right. And I really don't feel like switching back right now. I'm just gonna shoot the crap out of this guy. <clears throat> Come on, dude. There we go. Okay, cool. Let's break this down real quick. Get some health back. And we get a yellow orb. I'm kind of curious if those, like, bring you back right to where you are, or if it just, like... Uh, I guess that'd make more sense, actually. I was gonna say, or it resets the level, but that makes sense if it does bring you back to where you were. Alright, I'm gonna pause real quick, because there is a blue orb somewhere around here. Alright. I believe we go in here. Alright, same kind of room as before. What's this do? Okay, so I guess I had to do that. I wonder if that's timed. Get it. All right. Second one. I'll check out that room after I do this. Alright, before we grab that though, we're gonna hop down here and double jump underneath it. I think I missed it. We're actually just gonna kill these guys real quick just so they don't become a pain. Get out of here. These guys have like stupid health. For what they are, I feel like. Okay. How about here? I actually don't know how to get this. Hold on. Or is it underneath this? Hold on, let me pause real quick. It does say just wall jump to touch the bottom of the platform. I feel like I could see it up there. Does it does it appear on top? Okay, you just have to touch the bomb and it appears up top. Alright, now we can grab this gun. Alright, Nightmare Beta, a weapon formed in the underworld. Its powers are unknown. Gun collector, let's go. There. Just had to mark down that trophy real quick, because I think that's all the guns, right? Ooh. Let me check out what's in here real quick. I think this just like restores your uh, uh, devil trigger thing, whatever it's called. Go, go, go. Alright. Before we do the Lance thing, actually, let me kill those guys just for the red orbs. Come back here, buddy. You're not getting away. <clears throat> Alright. Cool. We've gotten a lot of orbs this uh, mission, actually. We start with, like, 2,000-something. So it does seem like it's a good area to, like, farm them. And like, killing the, uh... Edish things, whatever they're called. And also the fact that we've been having to fight these guys. Alright. Before we enter this door, we're gonna come back out here and head inside the area that we got Ifrit. Ifrit, Ifrit. Still don't know how to say it. If you do, uh, say it in the comments, please. Even though this will not be uploaded for a while, probably. 
because it'll probably take me forever to uh, uh, beat this game on Dante Must Die mode. Alright, so we can get a untouchable by doing this thing. Activating that and it will activate these again. You just want to do this parkour again. I hear growling. Whoop. That's the jump I hate the most in this. What? How did I fail? Mana. Oh, I'm on the wrong side. I I had the map totally flipped in my head. <laughs> that confused me. I wonder if you could just jump to that top elevator thing from like the starting area. Go. Good job. Almost there. All right, there we go. And we get a untouchable at the top up here. I need to pause real quick because I need to go grab something. All right, I switched to handguns again. And now we can head on to that boss fight area. Go, go, go. Okay, I'm just gonna skip this because the shotgun's definitely better for these fights. Yep, now we can head into this area finally. I'm actually gonna save this real quick. Thankfully, it only takes like two seconds. Alright, before we uh, step on the thing and start the fight, I'm gonna head over here. Uh, I might have had to go the other way. Okay, never mind. And to this thing, it should teleport us up. Mm, I think we take this bridge. I I'm just nervous. I don't know. I don't want to like screw anything up for the fight. Let me pause real quick because I really don't want to mess this up. Okay, okay, okay. So we're supposed to take this one. It doesn't matter, but. Then we can come out here and head up these stairs. Do I need health right now? No, I don't. And then come out this area. And I don't know where the blue thing is actually. Oh, is it up there? Oh, oh, you just walk out on the middle. Okay. All right. So from here, there's going to be one more yellow orb. Also, there's these health hit things here that I can use during this next boss fight. Um, I know you can destroy the bridge to where it kind of like stops you from getting in though. Hello? There we go. That was weird. Did I like go the wrong way or something? I might have went the wrong way. I don't know. I'm just going to circle around here one more time, and if I don't find it, then oh well. How many do I have? 11? Dude, I've seen playthroughs of people that have like 200 of these uh, yellow orbs. They must have like played through the game so many times. Okay, here it is. Alright. And now we can finally jump down to the bottom. Can I jump? Yes, I can. Alright, let's hop on here. I can hear someone speaking to me inside my mind. Offer a sacrifice to the Colosseum. It shall connect the path to the Wheel of Destiny. So we need him to do a certain attack where he shoots the lightning at us for like fast, I guess. Get him. Oh, that was a bad one. Why are you running into the wall? I'm holding left. Ow. Oh, it'd probably be better if I just go up to him and start whacking him. 
What is that hitbox, dude? I kind of need him to do that attack, though. Nice. Okay, not nice, because he just broke the freaking bridge. Now I can't go up there. Uh, I, actually, I might be able to. I don't think that actually stops you. Okay, so for the attack that I need to do, it says it more often does it after you break one of the swings. Okay. That's what I was waiting for. Right. Let's just make sure. Okay, 999, cool. So he's officially done. I was gonna do a quick like check to see like what all we need. Okay, after looking through here, the only thing we need are the last uh, Nilo ones. So whenever we fight him next, probably. All right, just walk right into that one. Move. I kind of want to get those red orbs. I right, just jump right into that. Okay, I might actually switch to this real quick just to make this go by faster. I'm pretty sure um, in harder modes it's probably better to use the pistols just because it's like faster shooting. Okay, I should be able to finish it here. I'm not really caring about my health right now. To be honest, he doesn't hurt enough method for me to like worry, I feel like right now. Blocked, let's go. Maybe it was too easy for you. Mundus. His heinous ways make me sick, killing even his own, like there were nothing. He's the one that took the life of my mother, my brother, sure. My mother used to always tell me that my father was a man who fought for me. He had courage and a righteous heart. In the name of my father, I will kill Mundus. In the name of my father, 
All right, well, it looks like we don't have to face Griffin anymore, so that's pretty cool. But... Oh, never mind. I thought for sure that was going to end the mission. <laughs> All right. There's something written. The King of Avalon shall turn the Wheel of Destiny and take the story to the beginning land. All right, we got the Wheel of Destiny. All right, mission cleared. Let's go. Got a B rank. I'm kind of curious what determines that, whether it's time or how much damage you take or both. I don't actually know. Anyways, that will do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. It would really help me out, and I really appreciate it. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number 16, Nightmare of Darkness. Let's get right into it. All right. So from here, we got a blue orb right here. A full one, actually. So that's pretty cool. Just a free uh, health upgrade right there. And then let's try to hop on back here. I hate how you can't add forward momentum after you're in the air, which I get it, but it's still kind of annoying. <laughs> All right. So we're done here for a second. Head outside the doors. And then we can head right back in and it'll actually put us into a secret mission. Start that up. And this one's not actually a fighting one. This one is probably going to be annoying. Because we have to jump off the heads of these guys. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I need to switch to Alistor, actually. That'll probably make this a lot easier. All right. I really wish I could control the camera in this game. I didn't mean to use that. All right. Actually, let's do bigger circle. Never mind, that made everything worse. Okay. Oh, I almost had it. Yeah, this one's kind of annoying, as you can see. No, I almost had it. Thank you, dude. I think I prefer the fighting ones over this. Okay, that one was just bad. Dude, if I can just get a good, like, camera angle on these guys, that would make this so much better. There we go. Got it. All right. Oh, and we get another health upgrade, upgrade there. Let's go. All right, let's just continue on. That's pretty great. All right, I actually want to switch my weapon to, to shotgun because we saw a couple of those floaty guys out there. And that should do it. Now we can finally continue. Mission cleared. Let's go. Also, I could have like upgraded uh, some of my stuff, but I chose not to just because I would have been at like zero. Because I want to get the like the special attack out of the store. Ooh. But that's like 4,800, I think, or 700. So we would have been like legit broke if we did. And I kind of want to keep money just in case we have to buy more health. Since we all know I like to take a lot of damage. I'm actually going to save real quick. Just so we don't lose the data of us completing that. All right. I think we've completed everything down here, by the way. So I think I'm safe to head back up here. I think this is what the wheel's for. I could be wrong. I don't actually know. Why do I keep hearing, like, random growling in this game? Like, are there dog things around? All right. I think we put it here. The Wheel of Destiny shall guide you to the land of the beginning. Shall I use the Wheel of Destiny? Let's go. All right.
Alright, I was actually kind of curious how that, that was going to happen. Is this actually going to stay down now? Can I actually, like, freely come and go from the castle now? Alright, let's head back in here. Oh, that was kind of creepy. <laughs> See my shadow. <laughs> Alright, so we are back in the beginning. And I see a blue orb, or a fragment at least. All right, so we got that one, and there's actually two in this area. It's actually a lot creepy in here, by the way, without <laughs> any of the lights on. All right, let's just try to get on top of this thing. Oh, come on. Let me on. I actually jumped over when I did this last time. Oh, okay. Is this fun? No, I think it wants me up here. Okay. Give me it. I just totally missed it. Dude, I keep missing it. <laughs> Let me up. Okay. This is a pain, but already all right i saw s or i read this thing says to use like the special attack with alistar but that's not working i'm just gonna pause until i get this you guys get the idea okay i finally got it that was annoying all right now that that one's over also i got on top of the horse's head and started jumping towards it and i just waited a second before i did the second jump so i kind of like jumped at it from Underneath it, kind of, to grab it, just because I kept over jumping it. Alright. I see this thing. Let's just see what this does. creepy okay okay let's head over here because i think that gives us like three right off the bat yeah and then the next thing is to attack it with anything other than alistar or, i mean alistar or uh whatever the thing we got before was Okay, that's not what was supposed to happen. Okay. I might restart this mission because that was not supposed to happen. <laughs> Anyways, uh, let's just see what we have so far. If we got anything else. No, we just got three. All right, made it back here. Okay, so I know what the problem was with the last part. I'm supposed to stay far away from him and then he like turns into a bat, which he just did, actually. Hello. Okay, I have to wait for it to shoot a thing at me. And that should have done right. All right, cool. And then for now, I'm going to equip this for a second. I don't know how to make this thing like Oh god There, hold on Let me Put this real quick Did that do that? The thing I needed to? Okay, it did. I think. Yeah, okay, it did. And then, last but not least for now, at least that's not what I meant to click. Alright. And that should have done something too. Alright. I'm gonna save it real quick. 
just so we keep those on my save file. And then finally, switch back to these. Um, actually, I'm gonna switch back to this too. It's supposed to clone itself, which I don't. Yeah, I don't know why he's not cloning himself. It's kind of screwing me over right here. So I'll be back again once I get back here. Okay, instead of resetting, I decided to kind of move on and just hope I run into more because I'm assuming I'm going to move or run into more. So just like, oh, yep. Yeah. There we go. Just save that real quick. And just make sure I got it, actually. All right, cool. We got seven out of seven. All right, now we can actually move on. I wonder if this gives us more uh, orbs. Okay, I'm getting my butt kicked. Okay, I need to, like, switch. Uh, do I actually? I'll just switch to that. I was going to switch to Owl's Store, but... I don't know if... Okay. Stop attacking me real quick. What if this is like a way to farm orbs? I feel like it is. <laughs> Cause they just keep up playing. Okay, 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 hold on. I'm just gonna finish these guys. Okay. <laughs> they did give me a lot of orbs though. <laughs> Which means I should be able to like, uh, buy the final upgrade for Ifri. All right. Next blue orb fragment right there. Alright. I'm gonna switch to this bad boy. And then I'm not quite sure where we're going. I'm just gonna pass all of these guys if possible. I think I might just going out here. Okay, yeah. There's a puddle. And then there's these things. Okay. I found out that this does activate these a lot faster. Okay, that didn't do anything. Um, do all of these do the same thing? Uh, I guess so. Oh. Strong surge of evil, evil coming from the puddle of water. There's a voice in my head saying something. One who knocks on the gate to the underworld shall borrow the strength from the blue stone. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is going on? Uh, who is this? Nightmare. Okay, they have 14, so I got two right there. I'm gonna save real quick. Alright. Is that even doing anything? I'm trying to unlock stuff with this. Okay, so I got one, two, three, and then something else in here. All right, I just switched to the grenade launcher. Um, get out of here. 
into that. Oh. That did not do what I thought I was going to do. What's happening? I'm confused. I had to have gotten some of this there. Eight. Okay, so one, two, three. Probably four, five. And then... I don't even know what I got. I gotta mark this all down real quick. Hold on. Okay, so I have my little wrist list that I've written down. I know, like, here... You want to do this for one? Am I, I'm actually going to save it real quick. Because that should have added another one. And so we should just need... Uh, three more, I think, for this fight. Alright. Now we can continue on through wherever we are now. Oh. We got a spider, it looks like. Is that Phantom or is that one of the other ones? Because I thought we killed Phantom. Oh god. Ow. What is it? To attack him head on. Yeah, he's not that strong. Get out of here. Oh, he's not dead yet. Get out of here. And give me your orbs. Um. Oh. I thought it was just gonna teleport me out. Okay. So it did that, and that takes a good chunk of his health, okay. Just punch the crap out of this thing, and run towards him. I'm like waiting for a specific thing to happen, by the way. Did that even do anything, by the way? Okay, it did. I need to find out what it is real quick. Okay. Okay, that's the other thing I was waiting for, and he does it right when I pause. Okay, yeah. Alright, now I can actually, like, kind of fight him. I think. Oh! Too fast. Should I get on top of him again? Except he put it away. He just tried to eat me up again. I'm gonna do this just because I don't want to die. Okay. Hey, you get him in the red, by the way. That's kind of what I'm aiming for. Did that do it? Because he's in the red. It did not. Okay. I'm actually not quite sure how to get this one, because he is in the red. So I don't know if it's waiting for me. 
or I don't even know what it actually wants. But I assumed it was like when I was in this state. Oh, well. I'll find him again, so it's not that big of a deal. I probably shouldn't stand inside of him. Um, okay, where am I supposed to go from here? Do these actually do anything? I don't know. One who knocks on the gate to the underworld to borrow the strength from whatever. Okay. All right. Let's uh, switch weapons real quick. Back to these bad boys. And actually... I'm going to switch back to Alistar right now. Alright. We're going to head backwards a little bit. Back down this hall. And we're going to ignore all these guys just because they are annoying. And then we are going to head right back inside this door that we came from. And that shall be secret mission number two of this mission. Let's get right into it. Are any of them in here? Oh, they're up top. I'm just gonna hop around until this guy explodes. And I get exploded run. Although he should drop health, right? Yeah. Get him! Ow. There we go. Ow. Okay. Well, he's gonna hurt me again. I hate getting stuck by these things when I know they're gonna die and explode like that. Let's head out here. I'm kinda curious. Can I actually buy stuff from the shop right now? I can. Just buy this bad boy, and then might as well spend most of my money and get this. And then we have two more upgrades left, which is going to be over 6k. There has to be one in here, right? Yes, no, maybe so. They're really not going to put one in here? That's kind of weird. Out here, maybe? That's unfortunate. Dude, come on. Come on, dude. Do your little exploding thing. Okay, there he goes. Where's this last one, though? Did they put him out here? I don't think so. 
I might pause until I find him. Okay, I just found him. Oh, he jumped down. Okay, that was the easy one. Which is kind of surprising because it's in the most like compact area. Oh god. Run away! Don't get caught! Oh. Oh, I'm actually surprised he didn't just catch me right there. Alright. And then don't forget this. Alright. Now he just... Oh, okay. So we get the next upgrade too. Okay, as I was saying. Now we gotta figure out where to go. Um... Head back through here. Secret mission cleared. Let's go. And then through here. And then we're back in this big room. Oh, wait, no. No, no, no. We gotta make our way through this hallway first. Forgot about that. All right. Head outside these doors, and this should take us to where we fought the boss. Which I think I figured out what I did wrong. I think I should have been attacking one core, but I also don't know if I would have been able to do enough damage to actually destroy one before he died. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so we're back out on this bridge. Is there something over here we had to do? Question mark? Oh, I almost just fell. Oh! <gasps> Oh, I should have just fallen there. I just freaked out. I thought I missed the jump, but I don't think I actually did. That's just unfortunate. Uh, what am I fighting? All right, just keep going around the circle. And one more. All right, and health, let's go. <laughs> cool, they just teleport me across. Let's go. Uh, can't interact with that. Can I interact with this thing? It's reacting to the growing evil surge of the darkness. Shall I use the staff of Hermes? Yeah, let's do it. So, the left one will end the mission, I believe. So, I think we want to actually take this one first. Alright, so we're back in this room. Blue orb fragment right here. And then there's also this bad boy up here. How many do I have of those? Untouchable. I know I want a lot of these because, like, you can kind of just scam your way through some of the later, like, uh, bosses. But anyways, after that, we can just hop down through here and end the mission. Mission cleared. Knights of Terror, let's go. I actually don't know what that was for, Eric. Probably fighting Nightmare for the first time, actually. Of course, we want to save the game. But anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number 17, Parted Memento. Let's get right into it. Okay, to start off, we want to go right back through this portal. And actually, I'm going to save it real quick. Even though we just started the mission, we don't really need to, but just to be safe, you know. And then we can... You have to get across this broken bridge without uh, falling. So you can probably just fly across. Because if you do that, then you cannot get it. So I'm going to reset real quick. Okay, attempt number two. I'm trying to save my flying, by the way, because 
you can use you use it during the mission. Oh god, no, come on. Come on. Oh my god, that was close. Okay, we got the secret mission, let's go. Okay. So the reason I wanted to save it is because you could jump off of his head to get this, but I think it's easier if you not do that. I don't actually know how to fly. That's a problem. Here, let me figure this out real quick. Okay. Oops, didn't let me do that. Okay, you press R1. That's why. Did it. Okay, I got it. Cool. All right. And then from here, we're fine to just fall into the water. Let's go. First try. I wonder if I... Okay. I was going to say, I wonder if I start to find my way out. And actually, I'm going to... Not that. I'm going to switch to my shotgun real quick, just because whatever I'm going to have to fight, it's going to be easier with that. And I'm a actually, I am going to save this just so I don't lose that uh, secret mission complete or the uh, blue orb. Okay. See? So much easier. And I don't have to wait for the reload for the grenades. Oh, I just got hit. They say easier and then I die. Oh, that was not the last one. Let's go. Beam me up. Now we can head right back through here. Uh, do I get through this one actually? I didn't realize they were both going to be open. Something scary there. Window. Or, no, no. Mirror. Scary. Okay. Let's just head back through here. And then jump back through this window or mirror. I keep saying window. It's a freaking mirror. I mean, I guess it's kind of a window. <laughs> if you think about it. Just head on up the stairs. Do I just like piss this every time I come up here? This would have scared the crap out of me as a child. Run through this uh, castle when it's like dark out. On all you have is a little light. Okay. What's going on? Oh, a new enemy. I don't think we fought this yet. Okay, for the first one... We want to shoot. And... Ice by standing behind it. Okay. Let's see what we have so far. Frost, 3 out of 10. Alright. Still needed to, like, shoot ice at me, apparently. Come on, buddy. Shoot your ice at me. Okay. I'm gonna save it real quick. I don't know if that was it or not, but... Just to save, like, the ones we have. Cross four. Okay, once again, it did not do what we needed to do. Get out of there. Okay, 
I might want to just kill one real quick. Oh, I just walked right into that. I need to use this real quick. Please tell me I got something. Six? Okay. Hold up. Let me go through my stuff real quick. Okay, so we got four. Let's just save real quick. That was interesting. Was that one? Sorry, I know this is kind of boring to watch for you guys, but I need to check. Okay, no. But I do want to attack one real quick. I need to break its arm off or something. Dude. They're kind of annoying, to be honest. <laughs> Let me equip this real quick. Oh, I killed him. Not what I meant to do. I'm just gonna let this thing heal me real quick while I run. It's not doing the thing it's supposed to. Like, if you get far enough, it's supposed to, like, summon uh, a blizzard kind of thing, I think? I don't know. Okay, let's switch back just so we don't kill it. Come on, dude. It's supposed to, like, lose its arm or something. But it's not happening. Oh, wait, it did, actually. Okay, hold on. What am I at now? Nine out of ten. Okay, let me go through my list real quick. Okay. So after you destroy enough of its body parts. Okay, well, I just killed it. But uh, it should heal itself. So I should just back away right there. So I'm going to reset real quick. Okay, so I was just fighting him again. And they ended up doing what I needed them to do. Which is like healing up from a broken... Or having their arms broken off. So now that they've done that. I'm actually going to save it real quick. Because I probably will die here. Ow. Hello? Yeah, okay, I died. Okay, let me reset. Alright. Made it back here, killed the enemies, um, putting a week later. So, uh, yeah, I don't remember exactly where I left off, but all I know is... I got 10 out of 10 for the enemy files for the frost. Now we can continue past this room. Oh. Dude, this game feels so much like kind of creepier with with the uh what's it called? The lights off and stuff. No. Thank you. Get out of here. Alright. I just need to get my way past all these guys. <laughs> okay. Get out of here! Alright, actually, before I move on, if I pause it, go to the map. 
There's that like glowing orb there, which I want to go visit. I don't know if that just means that's like a shop or something. Nope, that just disappeared. But if it is, I... Oh, I guess I can't do that just yet. It's probably where I have to go to like finish the level. I don't know. Oh God, that hurt. Get out of here. Okay, those guys aren't even that bad if I don't use the uh, the devil trigger, whatever it's called. I think that, I'm pretty sure that's what it's called, devil trigger. Oh, that's unfortunate. Whoa, double team. That's not fair. Ow. Dude, I keep getting turned around because of the stupid camera. Okay. I'm just going to do this to finish. Or not, because it didn't even activate. Cool. Get out of here. Oh, I can't interact with that painting. All right, let's head through the door. And the camera's a little weird. Why is the camera not straight? What the heck? Ooh. The power of the dragon has control over it. Wait, the power of the dragon has control over it now. It can't be moved. Okay. What am I doing? Ow. Strange power has confronted me. I've got to find a way to defeat the dragon. Bruh. Okay, okay, okay. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Okay, I clearly can't do anything here. That was close. Did I miss something over here? There's something written. The confronter of the path. Pluto's dragon. Prove your bravery with your sword and the dragon will fall in its own flames. Am I just hitting it then? Okay, I might die doing this. Oh, there we go. Is that all? Oh, no. Ow! Okay, I can't shoot it. Do I have to do this multiple times? I'm do I press triangle, but okay. I have to stand on this thing. There we go. So it just takes three hits. Okay, so apparently over here by the entrance, somewhere over here at least, there should be be a uh, blue orb somewhere. Am I just missing it? Hello? Okay, let me pause and like see what this is. Okay, I just got it on accident. All right, yeah, I just got it. It's out on this little balcony. You just walk out here and it's like just forward a little bit. But now we can move on. I hate that I keep getting stuff like off screen on accident. Okay. Um. I think I just jump on these, right? Has pause on accident. Whoops. Oh, yep, yeah, that was a fall. That was a fail. I just jump up on here and get my way back up. No, I don't think so. All right, I guess I'll restart. Okay, so that one's there. There, I think. Yes, yeah, I was going to say, I think it's diagonal, straight ahead, and then right there, boom. Imagine I just fell right there. It's a device to gather moonlight. Did I miss something? Was I supposed to grab something before I come up here? Hello? Oh, didn't something over here change? Whatever this is. Uh, 
Uh, okay, okay, okay. I thought I just had to do this. That was real, wasn't like turning. Go, go, go. Okay, so now I should be able to grab it, right? Just jump across here, jump across here, jump towards camera, go to the edge and jump diagonally, and then just forward. And boom. Not too hard. Quicksilver, let's go. Okay, so now I think we should just be able to go back to that one door that I tried to go to earlier. Actually. I can I might want to switch this real quick. As much as I like Alistar, these things like hit so much harder. Especially when, if we have to fight those, uh, uh, what are they called? I think they're called fetish. <laughs> the, like, fire dudes. Let's go health. Okay, is there someone over here that he's like walking onto? There he is. Give me the orbs. I need more orbs. You're not really dropping that many, unfortunately. Okay, why do you have so much more health? I wonder if these guys are infinite spawning. I actually don't know if that's like a thing in this game, if there's like any areas with infinite spawning like enemies. Sometimes it feels like it, but... Get out of here! Alright, I'm just gonna continue. Run away from mom! Alright, get here, take a right. And then we can interact with the, with the doorway. <laughs> Can't speak. The door won't open, there's a round hole in the center. Show the gem with the moonlight. Shall I use Quicksilver? Of course. Whoa. A man with guts and honor. I like that. But it's a shame you serve Mundus. I'm gonna save her real quick just so we don't miss anything. I don't think it really matters. Alright, so we're gonna be able to finish the enemy files for this guy in this fight. So the first thing is is just to like kinda of dodge around until he Not that. He should fly up in the air or something. Ow, okay. Like I said, I'm a little bit rusty right now. I'm playing this after like a week of not playing it. Taunting me. Ow. I need to like not nah, stop moving, kinda. Actually, I wanna see if it if he already did what I'm trying to No, he didn't, okay. Just keep dodging then. I don't know if I have to if I'm like supposed to be close to him when I'm trying to do this or not. Okay. Oh, I never bought it. That sucks. Okay. That's unfortunate. I might have to restart this. Okay, I 
I wanted to taunt him like that. <laughs> but I did it like the worst moment. For some reason, I'm just playing like really dumb right now and not dodging him. Ah, uh, that's unfortunate. Yeah, I don't know why he wasn't doing what I needed him to. Alright, I'll be back in a sec. Alright, so I finally got the enemy files I needed for this guy. I needed him to, like, fly up to the top and get these, like, sword things. And then I needed to spam him with the grenade launcher so that he would use them in protection mode. Unfortunately, that was, like, most of the fight. But I've kind of just been dodging him and doing this the whole time. Maybe I'll have to fight him again. I get half. Never mind. Sorry, <laughs> I didn't like capture most of it. You'll see in the later videos uh, when I have to play the Son of Hard or Dante Must Die mode. It's not that hard though. Just shoot him with a grenade gun and use your power ups. Okay, that was a crazy ending. Fallen Angel, let's go. Yeah, no, but that was crazy. So now we know that... Uh, what's his name? Ne Neo? Nilo? Whatever his name is. Nalo? Nilo? Was, uh, his brother. And then Trish is... Against us. <laughs> Alright, but yeah. Once again, I apologize. I didn't get that full fight in. I was trying to get the uh what's it called enemy files off camera because it took me several attempts at this fight to get them so i just kind of got them and then the fight was almost over but uh yeah it's pretty cool and i think we got the last one of his files just by defeating him and seeing that last cut scene so i will make sure to check that in the next episode so anyways if you enjoyed this video please feel free to leave a like comment and subscribe thank you for watching What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number 18, Spirit Stone Elixir. Let's get right into it. Actually, let me uh, go in here and buy this real quick just in case we need it. I don't know if we will or won't, but now let's hop right in. <laughs> Alright, we get Sparta, which is a pretty sick weapon, it looks like. Not gonna lie, this is my second time recording this. The first time got a little messed up, so... Yeah, hopefully this one goes better. But yeah, that weapon looks insanely cool. And we can swing it! Actually... Oh, it doesn't have a devil trigger, though, so I wonder if it, like... Just does extra damage on its own or something? I don't know. Alright, we are in the water. 
Let's just destroy these. These controls are so weird. I also don't like that I can't look around while aiming. Just grab this. Go inside this cell and at the back of the room we destroy this and get a blue orb fragment. And I believe, yeah, that's a 4 out of 4. Let's go. Get a health upgrade. Alright. Now we can turn around and try to figure out what we're actually doing here. Where we're going. Bro, that's so creepy. We just have a dead body there. Alright. So I'm assuming we're just going to be following this way. Can I break these ones too? No, I can't. Is there one next to me? Bro, where is he? Is he just circling me? Yep. Get away from me. I'm happy that this at least does like decent damage. Let me just collect all these real quick. Yeah, I'd be even such a bigger like pain in the butt if that didn't do a lot of damage. Give me the orbs. I need it so I can buy more heals. Alright, cool. I'm gonna pause it real quick because I know there's another blue orb coming up soon and I need to know where it is. Alright. I think I know where it is. I mean, not without seeing any of the stuff that the guy is talking about, but first we don't want to do this just yet. I think we just want to climb all the way to the top. Is it this one? No, it's not. Okay. Failed. Alright, I need to see where... This wants me to go. Okay, yeah, give me two seconds. Alright, I'm gonna try this one more time. If it doesn't work. Okay, there we go. Now it worked. Okay, now we can move on. That was weird. I guess I was just jumping over it. Oh, it is gone. I was expecting it to like light up or something. Okay, it was straight into water. I wonder if I could have just gotten in this. Where is it? Okay, it was this platform right here. I wonder if I could have just gotten it while swimming. What on earth just happened? Oh, why did that just spit me straight out and make me fall down again? Go, 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 go. Is it a timer or did I just like miss a jump that I was supposed to do? Oh, is the water like going down or something? That was weird. Yeah, I don't know what just happened. I see a door there, but... Is that where I'm supposed to go? Hey, buddy. Oh. Uh, I might want to switch to Alistar just in case. Just because I don't want to miss the jump. Okay, he just does that anyways. I guess it does matter. Oh, oh my god, that could have been bad. Okay, can I force it into that angle for this jump? Or I can just do that. This looks interesting. Philosopher's egg, a material used in alchemy. The heck, that's not what I was expecting at all. Um, am I going down to that doorway now? Or does it want me to go up here? I just completely missed it. Probably not there. Uh, probably that doorway then. 
doesn't hurt to check it out. That will be right there if you didn't know what I was talking about. Is this back outside? It is like that little courtyard area. Uh, am I just... Is this another nightmare fight? Because that's what these things were for last time. And this like wall thing. What am I... Am I interacting with this? There's something engraved. Those who seek the truth shall put the egg in the basket and shall warm it slowly with care. It will become a blue stone in the landmark to the rough roads. Shall I use Philosopher Egg? Sure. It may take some time for it to transform. Oh boy. I'm gonna have to uh, switch stuff around real quick. Pretty sure these still do the most damage. And then what else do I want? Probably a grenade, right? This time I need to um, try to break one of the things on its back. Get off me! Hey. Dude, the camera is gonna get me killed. Can I please jump up here, dude? That was stupid. Hey! That's unfortunate. I kind of didn't want this to happen because, um, uh, what was I going to say? Because, uh, sorry, I'm like distracted. What, what was I going to say? I didn't want this to happen because I didn't want to take health from him. That's it. That's all I wanted to say. Okay. My brain won't function right now. I kind of wish these guys dropped health. Get out of here. Oh, it looks like we're facing the griffin again. Because last time I did one of these, it like took away like a fourth of its health or something crazy like that. Let's go. So I wasn't really talking. I had to focus there a little bit because I know that thing would be able to kill me if it really uh, tried. All right, let's go back out here. We gotta get him in his armor mode again. See, dude, like I don't want that damage done to him. I also need this to do a certain thing, so. Break it. Actually, let me see if that is actually what I'm looking for. Okay, so that is complete. I forgot to check that. I'm going to skip this one. Oh, that's taking away my devil trigger. Ow. There it is. And then now it's gone, but who was that? Oh my god, dude. I think that's what I'm looking for, right? Please tell me that was it. It was. Let's go. Let's just save this bad boy so I don't lose that. Once again, I will. Stay away from me, buddy. 
I am trying to just attack the one that comes out of its butt back here. Dude, can this guy just leave me alone? Dude, I really don't know what I'm supposed to do for this last one. Cause I'll... Oh, I did it. I think. Hold on, let me pause and make sure I got the right thing there. Alright, so I got all the ones I needed. I need to right now. Which is pretty good. Dude, I swear if I die right here, I'm gonna be very upset. I'm dead. I mean, I could just... I'm gonna do it just because I have the orbs. I don't want to do it just because of how close he is. Which is very unfortunate. Whoa. I'm just gonna keep this up to keep his armor out. Oh! I did not realize I was at... Dude, if this camera thing would not change how it does... There we go. Transformation is complete. Okay, um, before you grab that... Equip this again... There should be another um, blue orb through this door, I believe, as if we go like all the way down this hallway. There it is. All right, now we can go grab the thing. And I apologize, I, I don't mean for this whole thing to be like a tutorial type of thing, like how I talk about it, but that's just how it comes out. And no, I'm not like showing everything to I'm gonna save it real quick so I don't lose anything. I'm not like showing every single like enemy file and stuff like that, which is kind of unfortunate because I wanted to, but just because of how they are and how like you have to do the fights multiple times sometimes to get the right attacks to happen and stuff like that, I'm just not able to collect it all because I don't have that much memory in my computer to hold all that footage. Anyways, let's collect this. The strange voice from the transformed stone is echoing inside my head. I am the first key to opening the gate of the underworld. The second key resides in the mirror dimension. Elixir. And mission complete just like that. Good night. Another trophy, let's go. I just want to keep it just in case. Okay, it's not gonna happen. All right. C rank. Get more red orbs. I don't even know what I'm gonna use the red orbs for because I can't buy any items really. I can upgrade my weapons and then um what else can I do? I mean I, I think I still have a couple of power-ups I can do. So like I could do another purple orb if I want to once I get enough. Ill orbs we don't really need. Those will come in helpful during the hard difficulties, but I don't know. Devil Star, um, I mean, we could buy those, but I don't think we need to. Alistair's already leveled up all the way. If we, we can level up, actually, but I don't really use any of these. I mainly use Inferno and then just normal punching. <laughs> so I don't really think I need to do that. Anyways, that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing Mission 19, Enter the Corrupted World. Let's get right into it. Okay, so we're just hopping right in here, I'm guessing. Uh... Okay, I guess we're just right back here. What do I do? 
I'm just gonna skip that level. I don't think there's anything for us in there. I just wanna see what's out here. Oh. Because I know there was a teleport here to the outside. The elixir is responding strongly to the other painting. Let's head right in. I'm gonna switch guns real quick. Kinda forgot to do that. As much as I like the damage that the grenade gun does, I do not like how slow it is. <laughs> Scary. Ooh. You're responding to Elixir. It is. I cannot read or speak. Okay, we got this weird effect going on. I don't know if I like that. Orbs have no use here. Okay. Sorry, I'm not really saying much. This is trippy and cool. Pick you up. Fluffs. Flood it off. Philosopher's Stone. I was looking away. I was like reading what I have to do. You know what? I'm feeling handgun right now. They're at least more accurate. Get out of here. Also, I wonder if this will be better. Also, sorry, I keep pausing it. I want to check this out real quick. So we got one out of eight, which is just for after the cutscene. What's it doing? Okay, I... He dropped an eyeball! I did not mean to activate that. You know, this fighting style reminds me of, like, Sanji from... Oh, this exploded. From One Piece. Except he doesn't use his arms, now that I think about it. Okay, we're getting some things out of the way here. Let me just save it real quick so we don't lose them, and then I'll go look at whatever we have. Ow. Get me out of here. Okay, that's another one. Okay, I need this guy to stop. Hey. I might die here. I'm gonna use this real quick because I kind of don't want to die here. And then let's look at this real quick and see how we are doing. Okay, we already got 8 out of 8. Okay, that was easy. So, no! Drop me! Actually, give me that. Okay. Let me save this real quick just so we don't lose those. And then did the other one die too? Okay. Get out of here, dude. There we go. Oh, I... Okay. <laughs> I didn't realize they exploded like that. Okay. I'm gonna pause the video real quick and I'm gonna go through all of the enemy files and make sure I have everything that I need real quick. Alright, we got everything we need to pretty much. But before we leave this area, there are some blue orbs for us to grab. Might take me a couple tries. There's one right there. Do I even have enough? No, I don't. Um, I'm gonna have to do this, which I don't want to, but... 
do this and fly out. I really hope I hit this. I missed, dude. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna have to use another one. That's really unfortunate. I kind of need to save those for harder modes. I also wish there was a way for me to like actually uh, line this up. All right, I guess we're gonna have to use another one, which I am not happy about. There we go. All right, so we have that one. There is another one here though. I think it's over in the same area though. Kinda. Jump up here. But is it this way? No, it's not. Where or oh, where is it? I didn't even have to fly, dude. I could have just dropped down. That's unfortunate. I was just following the guide instead of fly out to it. All right, blue orb, and I believe that's another full blue orb for another health upgrade. And there's only one more, and I think it's a full one, which is pretty great. I did not mean to just do that. Am I heading in here? I actually don't know where I'm going. Am I just leaving this? I have no idea where I'm supposed to go from here, to be honest. Okay, wait, wait, wait. I might be just heading back in. It looked like there's a thing inside the building. Okay. Oh god, that was close. Alright, I got through the parkour though. Please tell me this is the right way. Alright, cool. The surge of evil is reacting the power of the elixir. It's starting to activate. Go towards it. Nice. Pretty cool. This is creepy. Let me up. Oh, I can actually go up. Oh, I guess that's the exit. Okay, bring me back in. Beam me down. The evil darkness is rolling with its mouth open. This must be the gate of the underworld. Exciting. <laughs> Shall I use the Philosopher's Stone? Yes, sir. All right, let's jump in. I don't know why I keep talking like that, by the way. Anyways, that is a mission clear. Uh, D rank? I didn't do that bad, okay? Oh, well. Let's just save it and move on. I'm actually going to save this to another one because that might be a mission that I am going to be able to get through without getting hurt. Because I still need that trophy because I failed the easiest mission in the world to get that trophy. Anyways, that'll do it for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number 20, Showdown with Nightmare. Let's get right into it. Are we just like inside a big version of Nightmare or something like that? Uh, oh, I didn't even see that. Tear through it. Actually, let me jump away from this guy. Um, 
probably be smart if I just switch to this. Oh god. That's unfortunate. We both jumped at the same time, so we didn't get hit by it. Okay. Here's a shop. I'm pretty sure I bought... Yeah, I did. Uh, once again, I could upgrade that. I just... Actually, let me go look and see if there's any trophies for upgrading this. I don't think there is, but... Might as well check. Okay, so I just looked. It actually is a trophy. So I am going to have to buy this. I just need that one, which hopefully I can get after this mission as long as I don't, you know, die. Or have to use up another one of those, uh, the uh, heal things, whatever it's called. Sorry, I was looking away. Okay, so the last enemy fall for this guy takes place after the first stage of this fight. So does he survive pretty much? I can't see what I'm doing. I probably should have let him say this goo thing because Okay, he's going in there anyways. Okay, let me just hop in here. Oh, okay, okay, this is what I was waiting for. Let me out. Okay. I think that was it though. Let me see. Okay, yeah, so nightmare's complete. I am going to save the game real quick. Okay, I got everything I need, so I can just fight this guy normally now. I mean, I guess I was trying to find him normal, but... Get it! Oh wait, put it away. Dude, I really wish I could see what I was doing right now. Actually, I'm gonna switch guns for this fight real quick. Okay, he brought me under anyways. Um, I'm gonna switch to grenade launcher. Just cause I got my uh, devil stuff back pretty fast. Ow. All right, so I should get a health from this, right? After I beat the actual final boss for this area. Alright, there's that one. I'm pretty sure there's one over here. Is this the last one before the final school? Yeah. Oh god. I don't know how I just did that. There we go. Not too hard. Give me the health on orbs. You know, I probably am gonna have to freaking. I'm not just gonna use it. I don't wanna risk it. Alright. Let's head back over here. Okay, that did a good amount of damage. Oh, I have a full thing. Okay, I need him to, like, open up his stuff at an angle that I can actually see. Like that. Get it before it goes back. 
Okay. Go, go, go. No, it already put back. Are you kidding me? Just so we're clear, the only reason I'm shooting him with the grenade launcher is so I can get my devil stuff back. Especially because he keeps taking it. I'm going to do this so that he stays in this form. I honestly don't know how I'm doing that. Should probably figure that out. Can I get on his back, please? There we go. better than to trust a stranger. Your presence has become a hindrance to my master's bloody scheme. Now die! No. I got betrayed. Oh god. Whoa, stop shooting me. Okay, that's not gonna help. He missed. Sucker. I can't shoot up, I guess. Yes. Let your orbs out, mister. No, he put her away. Okay. Get it, get it, get it. Oh, he is hurting me bad. I need to change guns. I'm gonna do that, and then I'm probably gonna do this just so I can jump around too. Okay, this is working. Kind of dodging most of the stuff he's throwing out. I'm still able to shoot the orb. Oh no, he got me. Come on, dude. Get it, get it, get it before he gets me. Thank God. Memory's over. But you'll never have her fire!
Yeah, that's right, Dante. You tell her. I uh, see. Come on, man. Yeah, that was my best fight. Almost died there then. But, on the bright side, I can buy the last upgrade. Uh, question is, do I do that? Oh, I get another heal. Because we all know I need it. Oh, I, I just have another. Okay, I'm not going to do that just yet. I want to have at least a little bit extra red orbs before I do that. But uh, yeah, that will do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we're going to be playing mission number 21, Living Cave. Let's get right into it. All right. To begin with, we're going to head right back through here, I thought. Yeah, okay. This is going to be the room where we fought Nightmare in, and somewhere in here, I don't know exactly where, we're going to just have to kind of look around. Right there is a untouchable. All right. Now that we have that, we can just head right back through this door. Alright. Once we're in here, there's also going to be something for us to pick up in here. As long as I can find it, it's right here. Let's go. Holy water. Alright. Now, apparently from the opposite side of this... Which I don't know if it means like directly cross right here. Okay. Press the right there and it'll put you into secret mission. Find the hidden bangle that resides in the secret corridor. Alright. Let's get right into this. Not exactly sure what I'm doing in here to be honest. I'm gonna switch to this though. Because I do know there's like somewhat of a boss fight kind of thing in here so. Uh, Ollie, stick to the right. Oh, did not realize I was right there. Okay, and we get a trophy. Let's go. All right, well, there's that. That also means we uh, have. Full HP now. How much health do these things have? Okay, now I just can't hit them. I'm actually gonna switch to uh, this thing. E free, still don't know how to say it. Ow. Get out of here. Oh, get away. I do want your red orbs, though. Oh, he gave a lot. Yeah, we want all the red orbs we can get right now, just so we can get that last upgrade. Actually, does it want me to upgrade his... the purple stuff, too? Is it not dead yet? Okay, yeah, it is. I was gonna say that's insane if that didn't kill it. Alright. Just keep on moving forward. And then eventually we should run into whatever we're looking for. I think it's dead. Okay. Might only take one of those, which is pretty good. Let's go. Alright. What's here? That looks so weird. What the heck was that? Oh. Do I get hair if I stand in here? Okay, no, I don't. Um, uh, what is this thing? Destroy it! Give me all the red orbs. 
I wonder if this gives me double trigger stuff. Or uh, whatever it's called. What is up there? Hmm. I wonder if this is doing damn shit. If I get Devil Aura, then... Okay, no, I don't think it is. Otherwise, it'd be filling up the bar. Uh, how do I get up there, though? Do I have to, like, switch so I can double jump? Okay, still not doing damage. How on earth am I supposed to get up there? Oh, I see now. Let me up! Can I hit you with this? I can. Oh god. Actually, I wonder if that is doing damage to him. Maybe not. Okay. I might have to punch him. Oh boy, you got some ice buddies. Um... Do I have to go back down there? I feel like I have to destroy that thing. Oh, okay. Oh god. Dude, they're destroying me. Can they stop dropping? There we go. So am I not destroying that? That totally looks like something you're supposed to destroy. I guess not. Okay. Let's head up to the, uh... I think they're elevators. It looks like the same thing I jumped on a couple episodes ago. Alright, just about there. Jump across here. Okay, yeah, they're elevators. That's unfortunate. <laughs> also, that fire looks really cool. Um, I'm curious if that was it. If it is, we should be getting another trophy, which will be trophy number 24. There we go. Oh, uh, I could just jump on the land there. Oh God. Okay, I am going to switch so I can get my double jump. <laughs> I keep falling and it's not fun. Alright, attempt number three. You know, I equip that and everything, but I really don't think it's going to help. Okay, help there. What is this? Bangle of Time, a mysterious wristband that has the power to stop time. Can I actually use that? Alright, another trophy! Alright, I'm gonna pause it real quick. Alright, now that's complete. How many orbs do I have? Do I still have? Yes, I do. Okay, I am just going to do this real quick. Come down here and upgrade this bad boy. Let's go. Alright. Sorry. I know it's taking me forever. Alright, now we can move on. It's taking me forever because I'm like updating my little Excel sheet on the side of like markers for when I get certain like uh, trophies and stuff like that. But now I can focus on this. Okay. I just freaked out that I was gonna like jump and like die. Okay, so am I just trying to like escape that this place now? Okay. Hopefully that's the last pause. Oh, what's that thing? Let me up! Oh, 
Okay, that was just to open the door, I think. That's creepy. Uh, I'm assuming I can't go in here. Oh, uh, it's connected to the giant heart in the room. Oh, I kind of see what's going on. Uh, is this like the castle? Am I like dumb and just figure that out? I think I came in this way. Whoops. Yeah, I did. Okay, so I opened up a doorway. I just need to figure out where that was because it wasn't the main doorway. But where was that doorway? I can't even attack that. Do I have to go backwards a little bit or what? I think I might have to. Or I can get up there, but I don't know if I actually can. Cause like, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know where that doorway is. Probably gonna spend like an hour trying to find it and then realize, oh, it's been right there this whole time. I mean, I guess I could go back to the area that I fought. Oh, I didn't even see this. Okay. <laughs> Found it. These doorways are so weird. You know how I feel about them. Walking in so something's like mouth or something. Oh god, that's creepy. I don't know how I feel about this level. Let me through. Oh, is this a dead end? Okay. Maybe don't let me through this way. This way. Okay. I don't think I have to swing unless they like actually grab me. Will this thing stop jumping, please? <laughs> like I could just spam that over and over again. Oh! Okay, I guess I can't stand still here. That's good to know. Alright, here's another one of these things. Dude! Just hit it! Dude! That big fire shouldn't be that hard for you to hit. Ow. Okay. Well, that's it. I'm switching to this, and then you're gonna get annihilated. That's not what I meant to do. That's what I meant to do. See what I meant, buddy? You don't mess with me. Now give me health, please. Alright. Let's keep heading forward. Get off me! You can't latch on to me! Okay, maybe you can. Get out of here! Dude, I don't like these things. They're so creepy. Hey. I'm so happy I figured out I could just kill them in one hit with that. Let me through! I feel like I'm just like going into things like mouths or something whenever I go through any door in this area. Oh god. Okay, I need to switch my guns. Because that is not good unless it's a stationary like enemy. Oh, <laughs> uh, I remember these things. They like... Don't they multiply? Maybe not in their bat form. Let me up! Uh... Oh. Uh, I was 
say, what on earth am I doing from here? I almost just jumped out right off right there. That would have been very unfortunate. Ow. Where you get? Before they kill me. Thank you. Okay, I'm just gonna shoot him. Ow. Ow! Can I just do this? I just totally missed. Okay, cool. Oh, it works! Let's go. That thing is so strong. I'm actually surprised it worked on them since I'm flying. This kind of reminds me of a Jack and Baxter level. Like, uh, where you're in a cylinder shaped room and the water's rising, you have to, like, try to beat it up. Not, like, punch it, of course, but, like, beat it up to the top. Okay, just to be safe here, I'm gonna change. Like, I think it's gonna, like, okay, yeah, that's what I thought. I just want to be safe, okay? And open sesame. Open the door. Oh, I just fell. Let me up. Go, go, go. If that's it, I feel like I could have totally beaten that without getting hit. Yeah, I think I could have. And I got more red orbs. Let's go. Save the game. Dude, almost 200 saves on this file is crazy. Anyways, that will do for this episode. If you enjoy... I did not mean to start this. Anyways, as I was saying, if you enjoyed this video, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today, we'll be playing Mission 22, the Legendary Battle. Let's get right into it. All right, we got a little sneak peek of this last mission because I accidentally started it. <laughs> but yeah, let's just walk down the hallway. This is definitely a completely different vibe than what we're used to in this game, though. Let's go. Trophy. Again, I must face a Sparta. Strange fate, isn't it? Strange and ironic that it will end the same way. <laughs> I he has favored you this time. Look there. Trish! Don't even think about it. Blink. She dies. You! Dante!
those eyes. Deep in them, I see the same light as in Sparta's eyes. Why my mother? That useless being. If you need a mother, I can create it. As many as you want. Just like I created Trish. Silence! Yo, I can fly. Okay. So, just dodge everything. Now, dude. Come on, man. Okay, I'm gonna get destroyed because apparently I don't know what I'm doing here. Am I supposed to be doing something specific here? I'm confused. Okay. Destroying these things. Get them! Ow. I'm getting wrecked. What's this? Oh, I should have been doing that the whole time. Okay. Let's use this one, don't I? Well, at least now I know. Especially for the harder difficulties. I'm doing such a bad job of hitting these from a distance. There, there we go. Let's just do this. It should be able to finish him off, right? Yeah. I wonder if it does more damage the more it's powered up. I'm also curious if it'd be better if I just like restart and redo that fight without using my uh, heal. So I'm not just shooting him. I don't exactly know what I'm trying to do here. Okay. There's gonna be a lot of things that can just hurt me. Holy crap, dude. Not gonna lie, that scared the crap out of me. Alright. 
Time to restart though. Wonder where it's gonna start me from. Oh, I have to restart the whole thing. Dang it. Alright. I'm gonna try this a little bit different this time. Did not mean to click that. I'm gonna click through this and see how much damage it does. Also, I kinda wanna see something. Can I hit him? Yes, I can. Oh, that does a lot of damage. Okay. So this is what I want to be doing. <laughs> I move. Is that the thing you did before that just like totally destroyed me? there. I'm gonna keep rolling. I don't trust that. I just rolled right into that. That's unfortunate. I need to try not to die, dude. Dude, come on. So close. Alright, so I made it back here. I must be blind because there's a uh, lava dragon that appears in this fight that I haven't seen until this playthrough at this level, which is like my third time playing this level, mind you. Okay, I need to start moving. Go, go, go. Oh god. Come on, dude. Dude, come on, just get up. I can't right now. Get him. See, that lava dragon. I did not see that any other time I played this. Okay, cool. But anyways, I killed it and it gave me full health, so that was pretty cool. <laughs> My father's also here now. Rest in peace. All right. Interesting stuff. He's leaving his blade in Mother's amulet thing. There's no way she's dead though, right? I feel like she's not dead dead. <laughs> but anyways, I feel like I'm gonna have a tough time with that fight during the harder modes. Hopefully not, but I guess we'll see. 
But anyways, that'll do for this episode. If you enjoyed, please feel free to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. What's up everybody? Welcome back to my Devil May Cry Let's Play. Today we're going to be playing mission number 23, Mother's Guide. Let's get right into it. Oh god. Um... Am I just trying to leave? Should I have grabbed anything from Trish there? I was not expecting to start off with a freaking timer. Okay, um... I'm assuming I'm trying to just leave this area, so I have to come get out the way I came, which I don't remember where the doorway is. There it is. Go, go, go! Okay, I'm pretty sure here... The door is, like, over here. Nope, not that one. There it is. Let me through! Okay, from here, where do I go? Let me through! Oh, I have to beat these things. Okay. Uh, I want to switch to if you. Oh, I didn't get this guy. Wait, how did I not die? Get him! Did I just miss that? Oh yeah, okay, never mind. Get out of here! Dude, they take forever to fully die. Thank you. Go, go, go! Uh, do I need to buy anything? I probably should have checked that before I started. No, okay. Uh, is it just through here? I kind of wish I knew where it was. Oh wait, do I just do this? Oh, okay. Now I kind of know where we are. Uh, is it on this side? Yeah, okay. Let me up! I wonder if that's gonna keep going or if it's just to get out of this, like, dimension. 23 Mother's Guide. Escape Mount Island before it collapses. Uh, I'm just gonna go through here. I don't know where I'm going, okay? I just know that other one leads to outside. Leave me alone! Ow. Hey, don't hit me. Leave me alone, please. Oh wait, I have to fight these things. Uh, okay, cool. Is that not all? Oh, okay, just took a second. <laughs> just gonna say, come on, man. I actually have to go back and grab those red orbs real quick. Okay. How much more is there? Am I trying to make it back to the main hall? Or not? Okay. Back in the sewers. I'm not gonna know how to get back out of here. So it's not the best. This will be your burial ground as well. Alright, I'm gonna change to this real quick. Just because I feel like it's gonna do the most damage. Um, I'll just do that for now, I guess. Oh god. Just 
Stay away from me. Look at its eyeballs. Those are creepy. Okay. A little bit more and then I'll use my devil trigger. Okay. I'll just do it now. Get out of here. There we go. That was easy. power and Trish's power into your guns, Ebony and I every then use your double trigger and blast a big shot into Mundus. Sweet. Is it better if I just do this? Okay, no, I can't even like hit him. I actually gotta switch the sword. I don't know if it's like a range thing. Maybe I can hit him better with this. Okay, that's definitely working better. Okay, get away from me. I guess I didn't really have to charge it all the way up, did I? It looks like we have a winner. Jack. Give my regards to my son, will ya? I feel like it was really random. I mean, I guess it was in the room above. Never mind. It's not random. I was going to say, I really love this game, but it is also very cheesy with the lines. <laughs> Alright. Let's rock. Let's fly the plane out. Yeah, I kind of forgot that, that room had the plane in it. Oh, God. I don't trust myself to fly this thing. Ow. See? Yep. Nope. At least I start off with full health. It's gonna be sad if I die here. D that okay? That was just bad. I flew right into that. Never let me fly a plane in real life, please. Oh, little twisty there. I don't know where we're going, bro. I am so bad. Okay, cool. I think you're there. Hopefully, that's not a problem during a harder difficulty. Like it doesn't do more damage or anything. The sky is fair. 
above everyone's head, no different. Like the sky. I feel like my heart is becoming clear. Let's not forget, though, the Underworld's evil is still alive. They will someday return. There's no need to worry, right? Because the world has the legendary Dark Knight Dante and his sidekick. Devil never cry. Yes. Okay, great. Where's the place? We'll be right there. This one has the password. Sounds heavy. Okay, let's get it over with in ten minutes. I can't let a single one of those suckers live. Five minutes. <laughs> More than enough. Let's go. We did it. Now we got two more playthroughs on a harder difficulties, which is going to be pretty hard. I'm not sure if I'm going to do like a couple of normal playthroughs before Dante must or Dante must die. Is that what it's called? Yeah, Dante must die mode. Because uh, from what I've heard, that is supposed to be very difficult. And that's why this game is an 8 out of 10 in difficulty on uh, PSN profiles. So, yeah, I might do a couple normal runs to uh, collect some items just to, you know, make it a little bit easier. And I also have to go back and get the uh, Untouchable Trophy, I think is what it's called. Beat a mission without getting hit. Because I kind of fumbled that on mission 4 or 5, I think. I forget which one it is. And I should get your two trophies at the end of these credits here. So I'm just going to let play. Hopefully I get them. But yeah, if you enjoyed this video or the series, uh, please feel free to leave a like, comment, subscribe. It really help me out. There are going to be a couple extra videos after this one for the two hard difficulties and then probably a path to platinum video for this. But uh, yeah, anyways, thank you for watching.
Two millenniums ago. Devil May Cry. <laughs>